I don't know, maybe I'll get a job working the night shift at a supermarket. Hey, where's the vegetable aisle? Yeah, right, it's 2 a.m. You're not here for vegetables. <sighs> well, I got the 12 <laughs> come. <laughs> Today, we are here to check out a ton of Family Guy cutaway compilations that you guys sent me in the DMs of Discord because you told me they would make me laugh. Let's do this. Why are you looking at me? Because you're terrible at keeping secrets. Well, I'm not. I'm great at it. Like when I was an OBGYN. What the hell Well, is I that? got the results of your ultrasound, and I got some news for you. Wait, wait, wait. We don't want to know if it's a boy or a girl. Oh, okay. Well, it's not breathing. Oh. You really think that'll work? Absolutely. And when it does, I'll be as popular as the first kid in school to get his driver's license. Hey, heard you got your license. Maybe after school you could take me to get some groceries. Ooh. Yeah, Ooh. or maybe you and me hop in that car of yours and do some grocery shopping. Oh, Looks like you shit. have a roomy back seat. I'd love to fill that with groceries what? after school. No, what did it? That's... Hey, it's no. Stewie. All I know about cars is what my mom does. Bro, that last one wasn't... The words are just pouring out of me. I have more energy than a guy who caught a t-shirt. Who catches a t-shirt? My wife can wear this to sleep! My wife can wear this to sleep! That's not even exciting! <laughs> Quagmire is dead to me and needs to be dealt with in an appropriate manner. Shame. <laughs> Shame. Oh. Shame. Shame. What did he do? Shame, shame, shame! Shame on you! Shame, shame, shame! Shame on Q. This was serious, but it uh -oh. turned into something fun. Ah, sweet. Huh. Wonder what happens if I turn it on and point them at each other. God. Oh, my God. Did you also call into a talk show without turning down your radio first? What the hell? Is that what happens? <sighs> yeah, I guess you're right. This could never work. Like porn movies before sound. Hey, come on now. Run! No, wait, what? Oh! Ah! Ah! I've been this desperate to find something since Matt was kidnapped by that maniac. It puts the lotion on its skin. <laughs> oh, oh Meg, thank God I found you. Hey, remember how you borrowed my club card for the grocery store? Could you toss that up to me? Oh, you don't have to have the card. You can just give them your phone number. Oh, really? Hey, thanks, man. Hey, Meg, I like your new boyfriend. Every oh. pot finds a lid, huh? <laughs> Have What's fun, you kids. Oh, that's our boyfriend? Is that really you your boyfriend? Quit. What if Muhammad Ali had quit? Ah, my grandchildren. Who would like me to read them a book or maybe paint their name on a grain of rice? Honey, oh. dinner time. Ah, my favorite, hot soup. Oh. Right in there. Oh, right in there. Wait, oh, what? I really messed up. I haven't felt this bad since I drove by that speed sign. Is that a warm welcome? Is that what he meant with the with the suit? Your speed is fat. Oh. <laughs> oh. Really? That was the... Why would you do that for that? Now we just got to make Peter and Lois understand. Yes, well, if they want to make me into a monster like those people, we'll give them a monster. Like when Godzilla attacked Haiti. Oh, my God. Oh! Oh! That's, that's... Is it really like that? You can go back to being a normal boy and put all this behind you. Hey, Chris, wait till you see the funny thing I had him put on your cake. Happy sixth birthday, Timmy? Uh-oh, they must have mixed them up. Nice crank, you dirty little bastard. What? Okay, I'll take that. Here's your cake. Nice, I ate a great deal of it. Nice crank, you dirty little bastard. That's actually a good idea. Like the U.S. Army Reserves. We're completely surrounded. We need reinforcements. You know who could really bail us out? Somebody who works five days a week at Enterprise Rent-A-Car. Really? Oh, you guys don't know what you're talking about. Tonight, when they put that crown on my head, it's going to be the greatest night of my life. Even better than when I had my first kiss. That's not a, that's not a first kiss, is it? That's, what the, you know, I mean, does that count? You up? Is this sexy? Is that what that is? God, look what those pills are doing to you. My Putting don't. you on that stuff was a huge mistake. Cosby like inviting pills. a turtle to a cocktail party. What? 
Hey, ask me why they call me a box turtle. Oh my god. Um, 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 oh no. He uses he teeth. Relax. Chris is just going through a phase. He'll grow out of it. Just like you grew out of your walk like an Egyptian phase. Paul was a good man. A good friend. I'll I'll always remember how supportive he was when I'm sorry. I'm sorry, I can't, I can't, I can't do this. What the fuck? I mean, what the damn? Coming up, quintuplets born at Quahog General. What? Really? That's, oh, that's supposed to be burn? Oh, coming up, quintuplets burn at Quahog General. Oh! This show is our whole life now. Yeah, if we don't find that tape, we're screwed. Motherfucker. Like anybody who goes scuba diving with Dave Navarro. What's Dave Navarro? Who, what the hell is a Dave Navarro? Oh, what's wrong with him? No, what's wrong with him? Oh! <laughs> Joe, what, uh, what do you want to do? I don't know. Sucks that we're stuck here alone. <laughs> Wait a minute. Here alone? You taking what I'm taking? This was not what I was thinking. That's weird. It's not what I was thinking either. I don't even know how it happened. No, me neither. But this spaghetti is not half bad. That's gross. A happy mistake, we'll call it. That's not, that's not happy. That's nasty. That's all the way nasty. Never eat dinner with dudes while they're naked. They'll get the wrong idea. And next thing you know, somebody's calling the police. <laughs> Hopefully it's you. Why would you think that? Well, I know a thing or two about performing. I mean, after all, I was Vin Diesel's acting coach. Uh-oh. Okay, Vin, I like what you're doing there, but I want you to try it one more time like this. Duh! Why would you have him do that? Is that... And don't ever speak to me again! What the hell? Who is he fighting? Oh, that turned ugly fast. Just like my trip to Tampa Bay. Hey, city boy, what's with the arm pants? What? Arm pants? Come on, you guys. Joe's gonna be fine. He'll fit in great there. Not like when I went to Hogwarts. Slytherin! Hufflepuff. Housing for registered sex offenders. Oh. Ah. Oh. We now predator. return to Wes Anderson's Pan Up, Pan Down, French song, The End. What type of shit? Yeah. Nigga, you mother, you dirty son of a bitch. Wow, that was amazing, I think. Africa? We're going to Africa? I wonder if it will change us. But of course, it did change us. I've been working here for 50 years pretending I'm a woman. Do what? you ever regret not having children, Mother <laughs> What? Oh, I've had many children. Ew! Is that, is that dirty? It's not EDP in disguise, is it? Because that nigga's crafty when his cupcakes involved. So you're just going to be a dancer and a drug addict? For a while. I might crash when I'm 18, but then I'll just turn to the Lord and working Mother out. Oh. I'll, I'll just be a 180 degree different type of insufferable. Oh. I used to need drugs to feel powerful, but now my power comes from my core strength. And let's look at that word, strength. The S stands for sacrifice. No gain without sacrifice. The T, of course, stands for the sufferings of the cross. The R... You want some cocaine? Oh my God, please, yes! That's all I want all the time! <laughs> I don't care. I couldn't stand another moment with Joe. It was torture just watching him do a crossword puzzle. Hey, Bonnie, what's a five-letter word for marriage? Fraud. Oh. That's got to start with a U. Nigga, that is a four-letter word for fraud, Boy, nigga. you stink at this. Fraud, nigga. It is fraud. I can't believe we're really in India. Oh, look over there. Those cute little kids are playing cowboys and Indians and Indians. I'm going to shoot you with my six gun. I'm going to shoot you with my bow and arrow. I'm just going to stand here wearing a shirt that appears to be a jacket. Saturday night, you and all your wives are coming to my place for dinner. Fine, we'll be there. Oh, can we make it Sunday? Saturday, I'm giving Javier Bardem a haircut. So, what'll it be? Everything. What do you mean? Long in the short places, short in the long places. Ew. It should be from both the future and the past. Something a child would do to a doll. What type of dirty shit? <laughs> I gotta tell you guys, I am so happy we found this. It's like when I found my thrill on Blueberry Hill. That's it? Just a bunch of blueberries? Ah, two dogs humping. Uh, this was worth the four-hour flight. What will you be having, sir? Yes, I'll have what I had last time, pheasant on the glass. Don't you mean pheasant under glass? Nope. 
Oh my god. Oh no. Yeah, now turn around and lay an egg on oh, the glass. I almost broke my computer screen. Come on, man. Oh, oh shit. Yeah. I what? defy you to tell me exactly what's wrong with this. Come on, bro. <laughs> what crap, what are we doing about our show? <laughs> now I know how that German movie producer felt. All right, Friedrich. Now that World War II is over, we can get back to making comedies again. Get me these comedy writers. Uh, I don't think any of these guys are available. What? This is terrible. Get me my agent. He's, uh, he's probably not gonna answer either. Well, this is crazy. What happened? Oh, I remember what happened. Oh, that sounds awful. Yeah, it can't be any worse than our trip to Hawaii. Okay, before you do anything else, I'm deathly allergic to pineapple, pork, rum, macadamia nuts, stupid tiny guitars, overpriced golf, sentimental military stuff, lava, people who I can't tell are black or Asian, apostrophes, anyone twirling flames, second weddings, and linen pants. Is there anything you're not allergic to? Yeah, the Epcot Center, where I wanted to go. Oh. You could always just ask Peter about it. No, he won't talk about anything serious unless there's a crackling fire to punctuate uncomfortable family revelations. I didn't fall off the roof. I jumped. So? I never found you attractive. <laughs> and what's more, I never respected you. <laughs> I know about Maurice. Oh! Oh! Which Maurice? Damn! Nigga, I'm Maurice. You gotta help me get rid of him, Brian. What? He's creepier than that guy at the gym who just does karate in the mirror. What type of shit? It's me. The guy's me. I'm a gym karate creep. Nigga, do that shit at home. I'm pretty good, too. But relax. If I wanted you dead, you'd be dead. I, oh, I can't stand those wow, people. Peter, in all the years I've known you, you've never even mentioned a sister. Big deal. I don't talk about my sister. I also don't talk about that tickling uncle. All right, Uncle Dan, remember, Hell no. no tickling. Hey, you got it. I ain't no tickling, motherfucker. <laughs> you didn't say anything about Uncle Neil. <laughs> Whose uncles are you? No. Oh, my God. Couch. That's one of those words that if you say it over and over, it starts to sound silly. Joe, you need to take a class on small talk. You're not going to believe this. I'm in one. It sure is cloudy today. Good. You could have also responded to Janet, who said her son died. I'm sorry your son died on such a cloudy day. Uh oh. <laughs> That's one way to do it. Oh, Stewie. You are just horrible. You're even worse than those people who take dumps in the shower. What? what? No! Why are you cutting to me? What are you doing? What did somebody say, whatever they said I do, I don't do. Oh. Uh -oh. You do that for me? Of course I would. I love cheering people on. Like when I go to NASCAR. Go in a circle. Go in a circle. Go in a circle. Advertise stuff. Advertise stuff. Go in a circle! I don't know. Let, let's just keep it new for a few weeks. A few weeks? Come on, you know I'm terrible at waiting for things. We'll be right back with more Laverne and Shirley. But I want it now! Oh my god! <laughs> oh! Shit. Oh! Oh! Come on, baby! Get your toothpick and let's get out of here. You ain't even gotta be all no, that, baby. thanks. That old lady has ruined toothpicks for me. Just like how Meg ruined broccoli. Hey, Meg, look. They're little trees. No, they're not. They're not? Peter, wh what's going on? They're taking me to jail. Oh. oh, my God. Don't worry, Dad. Oh. I'll send you a cake with a file in it. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> the manuals for all our kitchen appliances. Dirty motherfucker. Well, guess I finally have time to learn to reset the clock on the coffee maker. Oh. He never did. Oh. We haven't had a celebrity in a family since my great aunt, Queen of Burlesque Griffin. Oh, hell no. She hey, look, hey, hey, stop, send, stop sending me this, bro. Don't. Way back when. Hey, look, man. Hey, man. No hey, y'all just scarves. Good, good, fans, Lord. Hey, come on, bro. Gross. No, motherfucker. A terrible time for your penis to live Ooh. in. <laughs> you get home, son. I'm lucky I'm letting you off the morning. But you, you're coming with me. You gotta be kidding! You need a ride? <laughs> yeah, I'm just gonna stay here until the sun comes up and then be oh. the best at tetherball. Oh, God. Uh, 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 uh. Next! Oh, that hurt. It's a perfect oh. scam. Like Teddy Roosevelt getting to be on Mount Rushmore. I won the Revolutionary War. I won the Civil War. I gained possession of Guam. I'm gonna need y'all to stop hey, hey, sending hey, me that, to take this that away from one me. where this he This is danced. the only thing I've uh, ever been good at. Well, this and timing my farts to a thunderstorm. I can't do that, man. Why don't we all go ahead and turn to page six in the handout? 
first thing you're going to notice is a bar graph. And what that is, is to indicate our international sales, which peaked, ah, of course, yeah. during the last quarter. But now we're expecting that to drop off as we enter the colder weather. Motherfucker. The storm's moving away. Broke the whole, broke, you ruined everything. I always try to avoid Father's Day now. Every year I used to take my dad to the horse track. Now we just go rooting around for bargains at the mall. Oh, this is darling, isn't it? Uh-huh. Glenn, do you think you'd see my bra through this blouse? Uh, I don't know. Is it too sheer? I don't know what that means. Glenn, do you think it's too sheer? I said, I don't know. What the hell is sheer? Anyway, I'm gonna help Chris become a big, important success. The same way Mumford turned his son into a success. Okay, Dad, heading out to the concert. Now hold on a minute, son. Where are your arm garters? Your string tie? Your woolen vest? You look nothing like a dry goods clerk from the Garfield administration. But, Dad... No buts. You're a Mumford. Now get upstairs, put on a jaunty traveling hat, and write the same song 25 times. Oh. Damn. Peter, face it. Without Quagmire, we're boring. Oh, come on. That ain't true. That's yes, real. Yes, it is. He had all the fun ideas. Y'all boring. Remember, he even took me parasailing. This is awesome! It's like I'm flying! <laughs> I've never felt so alive! Oh, if only I had a pair of legs. All right! It was the fish part of me that wanted him! <laughs> oh. Relax, Brian. Stewie's fine. I mean, look at him. He's happier than a sunny side up egg. What a great way to start the day! What a pan! What a grill! Oh. oh, no! I'm at Denny's! Hey, I'm a oh. drug addict and it's midnight! Where's my breakfast? Help! He's only gonna eat the toast and put a cigarette out on me! <laughs> Where are you going? Oh, I'm meeting up with someone from my grinder app. Isn't that for anonymous gay hookups? No, no, no. This one's a way for guys who enjoy sandwiches to connect. You meatball freak? Uh -huh. All right, let's do this. What the hell? Man... Do people Are really... you also married? Oh, that's disgusting. What I've got to do is find a spectacular house that I can pretend is mine to impress Chadley. Well, why don't you just use Babs and Carters? I can't. They're having an eyes wide shut party all weekend. I can't find my wiener with this mask. All right, time out. Let's, let's all just find our wieners and then put the masks back on. She's in India. That's a lot to overcome. People in love can overcome anything. Yeah, I guess you're right. I mean, look at Jeb Bush and his wife. Honey, do you think I'll ever be president? No, no, no. Oh, Stewie! What? It's just a joke. Yeah, but come on. Look it up, man. Google it. I know what she looks like. Oh! Look, I'm telling you guys, it's gonna be a disaster. Just like the alternate ending of Back to the Future. Well, if I'm gonna disappear into nothing, I might as well bang my mom. Hey, Lorraine, wait up! That's horrifying. That is hey, horrifying. My name's Marty. Never I'm bang. In the picture. Never bang your mom, guys. To be contenders. That's what happens. That's what happens every time. I've seen it. Last I mean, time he kicked me off. I haven't like, seen it. I got a big day tomorrow. I got two shows. All right, folks. Big treat for you today. He's a little shy. Put your hands together for Sham Peter. I'm not shy. I'm angry. I'm in constant pain. This act has been condemned by over 30 nations. I'm gonna kill you all. Oh! Is that really what he's thinking? Man, I guess this whole friendship was a bad idea. Just like Goodyear's advertising strategy. All right, we have $14 million to play with. I say we spend it all on blimps. Because who do we want to reach? Drivers. And where are people looking when they're driving a car? Straight up. <laughs> I'm going to India. <gasps> oh my god, I'm going with you. My yoga class will be so jealous. Hey, everyone, the guy I told you about, Brian, he's taking me to India! Oh, my God! Hey, it's worth a try. Come on, Joe, don't be so negative. You're like a Boston fortune cookie. I don't know, numbnuts. Maybe buy a garage and fill it with hockey equipment. Huh. Well, let's see what my lucky numbers are. Screw you, math dick. <laughs> well, Screw. that wasn't very helpful at all. Screw you, math dick. We now return to Guy Friends. So, you must be pretty pumped. For what? Oh, Olympics? Oh, yeah. I guess that's starting soon. I thought you were a big Olympics guy. Yeah, I like them okay. Huh. Guy friends. 
A computer made us roommates in college. That's why we're friends. Hey, friends! Nigga. Damn it, that bastard is bailing on us. He's a worse accomplice than Johnny Windchimes. Hey. Shh. Sorry, it's my chimes. We now return to stand-up specials from comedians you've been told to like. Please welcome Aziz Ansari. What's up, y'all? Sometimes I start a sentence really soft and then get loud. <laughs> He's hilarious because I saw him in the show. Lois, Why is that I am funny? an unelected vigilante, and I take my job very seriously, like Serious George. Hey, George, want to go to the park? Uh, thank you, but no. It's a beautiful day. Lots of mischief to get into. I don't doubt that, but as you can see, I'm pretty busy. I'm trying to get a head start on my taxes. Oh, I see. Trying to figure out a way to deduct bananas? Ah, because I eat bananas. Terrific. Hey, you're inside, so don't wear a hat. Unless you're leaving, which would be terrific also. Besides, the fat man knows what he's doing. No, he doesn't. He's an idiot. You remember, he couldn't even figure out how to use a hotel business center. So, what business are you in? Oh, I'm just here to look at other people's emails who haven't logged out. And how's business? Well, I've left some pretty wild replies on a bunch of evites. Look at this. I'm bringing 53 guests. You're the coolest guy I've ever met in one of these things. Now, come on, let's go. So what, you're going to play tennis all day? No, I might also hit the treadmill and watch Kelly and Michael on mute with closed captioning. Kelly, it's like kale is everywhere these days, am I right? Michael, unintelligible. I love them. They have such an amazing chemistry. I can't believe I just kissed my friend's wife. I'm a bigger scumbag than Spock. I heard that there was a Romulan ship spotted in our sector, which means... Hey! Hey! What does that even mean? Lois? Is he scissoring? Oh, no. I'm alone and lost in the mall. Oh, my God. I haven't I'm, been this scared I, since the silence of the lamb. I think I love this scene. Hey. Um, oh, my God. Let's move what? in together. Motherfucker, what? You fucking jeep, lamb. Say something. It was, the sex was bad. Well, I like helping people out. That's why I was such a good breakup rodeo clown. I'm just going to go ahead and tell you. I've been sleeping with your sister. What? Oh, shit. Hey, now, hey, now, over here, over here, over here. Hey, now, hey, now, over here, over here. Hey, now, hey, now, over God, here, damn. over yeah, here. It's really like that. <laughs> yep. Oh, and now that I'm inside the barrel, he gave you and your sister HPV. Oh, never tell Peter, a woman. I can't believe you've kept your sister a secret. She's amazing. Yeah, she's crazy strong, like Superman on a date. Yeah, I wasn't here, but oh. I heard her scream, so I came flying in and found her like this. Oh. It's weird. Same cause of death as those three guys in that local public bathroom. Oh. Unsolvable. <laughs> Man, this is a pretty sweet gig. That's the beginning, Drew. Unsolvable. <laughs> Man, this is a pretty sweet gig. Like being a member of Daft Punk. Look at this old Casio keyboard from the 1980s that I have found. Watch what happens when I push this demo button. Hello, Daft Punk. Great song. Here's a Grammy. Oh, -ho! you know, it's funny. Until you spoke, I did not know we were French. Peanut, this is ridiculous. What am I supposed to do if work calls? Just do what I do. Hold the phone up to any episode of Who's the Boss? Griffin, it's been four days. Why haven't you come to work? Angela? Of course it's ah! You know, I've got half a mind to fire you. Angela. Oh, ah! I can't stay mad at you. I'll see you when I see you. Motherfucker! I hope I didn't cause you too much trouble. Shit. Nigga, yeah, that's, that's a rough one. Yup. Yup. This Nigga. is not a drill. I repeat, not a yep. drill. Full on erection. Yup. Good to be back doing this again, huh, Bill? What, shoveling coal into a penis? I was sleeping. <laughs> it's that time of year again. Are you a New England dirtbag who wants to run with bulls but thinks Spain is gay? Then don't miss the seriously wicked bull run in South Attleboro, Mass. You and your friends can run from a bunch of live bulls and lots of times there's a chick whose boob comes out. Order your tickets before it's too late. What the hell? Toilets Limited. My toilet is limited. So is Mayor of Quahog. I hereby raise the town's legal drinking age to 50. What? I can't drink anymore? What am I gonna do? What do people do who don't drink? I don't know. Knit? 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 Are you kidding me? Maybe. 
Uh, um, okay, so it turns out I am like crazy good at knitting. Ooh, I almost caught myself in the face. It feels on so that one. good to finally be where I belong, like Judd Hirsch at the gigantic sweater store. Hi, uh, all five of us are Judd Hirsch. Do you have a sweater big enough to fit all of us? Oh no. Okay, You're... everybody, climb in. Why do people? Is that? Ah, I can't wait to spill soup on this. That's terrible. Okay, Judds, shamble away. What? What the fuck is a shamble? I'll what? be honest, Lois. This hurts. Hurts like the Dickens. I Dickens. finished my latest novel. Splendid, Charles. What is it called? Oliver Nipple Twist. Nipple? Ow! No! Oh, you bastard! Yeah, the Dickens. Oh. It hurts like the me. You motherfucker! Ah, punch him in his face. What do you say? You guys with me? You bet. Sure thing, Peter. I mean, come on, we're a team. Like fish and chips and fat guys. Oh. I want the double cheeseburger, but I'm gonna go healthy and get the fish and chips. Fish and chips. Fat guys think we're a diet food. Ah, don't worry about it, Lois. I will always provide for the family, even if I have to shoot our dinner. This'll look great in my study. I'm a hunter, but I'm a silly hunter. I mean, can you imagine if you make a million bucks? You'll be happier than a guy on his wedding day. Thanks, everyone. Goodbye, Mom. Goodbye, Dad. Goodbye, friends. Ooh. Goodbye, free time. Farewell, sex. So long, golf on TV. I'll miss you, privacy. Oh. Goodbye, being honest about how many yep. beers I've had. Nice knowing you, my own choices. Yep. See you later, money. Yep. See you later, money. Oh, don't boy. worry, don't worry. I'm great at keeping secrets. Well, except for that one time you discovered my hidden shame. Peter? Brian, I'm, uh, I'm sorry. I'm one of these guys now. I'm sorry, Brian! I'm sorry! Peter, what the hell happened to my underwear? They're all stretched out. Oh, sorry about that. Me and the guys were using them to shoot crab apples at old man McCratchen's truck. We don't want raisins on Halloween! We want candy! Hey, Quagmire, aren't you gonna get in on this? I, uh... <laughs> I got my own game going on over here. <laughs> we now return to the NBA on TNT on LSD. What? Oh, shit. Man, I'm out my mind! Man. What? I never lie. Well, except for that one time. Oh, my God! My husband's having a heart attack! Well, there is, is anyone here a doctor? I have a 13-inch penis. Oh! Nigga! You're right. We need to do the right thing, like the dad from Small Wonder. All right, Vicky, time to shut you down for the night. Good night. See you tomorrow. This nigga just gonna tell people? Yeah, she knows what her mouth is. <laughs> she knows what her mouth is doing. I mean... Nah. Well, uh, I mean... <laughs> I never won anything. Well, except for when I won that Tory spelling bee. Peter, your word is equine. Peter reached this round by accurately spelling collagen. Repulsive and botched. Ryan, this can't go on. Chris is out of control. He's even more arrogant than an actor, writer, director. Well, my script is brilliant and I'm a great director. The question is, how bad do I want this part? <laughs> okay, I'll do it. <laughs> I'm very proud. Of you, you, my friend, are the greatest invention since the Trapper Creeper. <laughs> He glizzied his own god. We are binge watching this whole show. I mean, I haven't been listening to something since the Shawshank Redemption. Yes, um, after you escaped into the hole, how did you perfectly reattach the Raquel Welch poster from inside the hole with a tautness that a rock could pierce? Does it really matter? It does to me. Did you even like the movie? I did very much up until that point. Ah, this is it, Bry. The Quahog Racket Club, where frail old men come to weigh themselves in the nude. Does that say 84 or 85? Mm. It says 63. <laughs> oh, dear. How'd you get all those cuts on your butt? Oh, 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 God! You're right. I guess jealousy's my weak spot. Everyone has one, even Achilles. So you can only be injured on your Achilles tendon. That's right. My mother dipped me into the river Styx, and she held me by my heels. So that's the only part that can be injured. How about you, Testicles? It's the same. It's, it's, it's similar. Oh. And who shazams the Beatles? Whatever. Have fun with your little robot. But if you ask me, this whole thing is more disturbing than a dump after a beet salad. Ah! Oh, right. 
No, yeah. I love blacks, I love Asians. Hell, I even love gay aborigines. Oh, 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 oh. We now return to Star Trek Creep Space Nine. <laughs> Woodland creatures, no! These niggas is busting it open and dropping and getting loose. Ah, she saw us! Warp speed! Getting swifty. <sighs> All right, I'll go. But I'm not happy. You know how much I hate being told what to do. Oh. Mother, I mean, I, can't, I knew I wasn't the only one. We now return to the autistic postman always rings 400 times. What? This is great. We can put it right into Stewie's college fund. Yeah, yeah, but, you know, maybe we should keep a little bit out to celebrate. I mean, I ain't done nothing fancy since I bought those rich guy socks. Ah, there, I'm ready to get caught cheating with my secretary. I am sorry. Look, th th this isn't us. This is just the no food and sleeping in a car talking. Yeah, We it can is. make this work, like couples who meet on Craigslist. Oh, my God. Not on Craigslist. You're, You're not, not what, what you, you look, look like, like in your picture. picture. Let's they, get this, this over, over with. I've been there. That's been, I wonder I'm, which one of us is the murderer. It's usually her. Every time it's her. But, but we told Chris we'd be there when he wakes up from surgery. All right, we were able to fix your hernia, but you've got to stop lifting sewer hole covers. Oh. But the Ninja Turtles live down there. I'm friends with them. Nick. Hey, fat ass, I brought you flowers. But stay out of the sewers. We're trying to work down there. Thanks, Donatello. Mother... <laughs> Come on, that's ridiculous. How do you think you're going to do that? I don't know. Maybe I'll get a job working the night shift at a supermarket. Hey, where's the vegetable aisle? Yeah, right. It's 2 a.m. You're not here for vegetables. <sighs> Well, I got the 12 ah, cucumbers. Ah, What's wrong? Just ah, just come oh, never mind. You know what she could use? A little sip of that drink I invented. Hi, it's Dewey Griffin here with my latest creation, oh. Monster Energy Drink. What is it? Ooh. I don't know, but it's free from this truck that stopped outside your work. Crack Mix it with can, foods. Baby. Ever been wide awake, blacked out? Ever tried to jump over a train on a bike? Ever bit the beak off a bird? Monster Energy. Put it in your body and ask questions later. It's green, so it's nature. Yep, that's oh, how you're it is. really obsessed with Patty. You want her even more than I wanted the new iPhone. How's it going? Good, just looking forward to getting that new phone. What are you talking about? This isn't the Apple Store. This is a super gay club. Yeah, right. Oh, I my leave God. and you get my phone. Nice oh, tie, cutie no. pie. That happened to me once. We oh. return to Dateline. <laughs> Our story tonight, the guy you think did it, he did it. Now go to bed. Your grandkids are coming tomorrow. Oh, why are they we coming? We now return to The Price is Right. Now with male models. What? Let's look at this beautiful new car. Nigga, presented come on, by bro. Ken. I don't want to see that. Sh hey, come on, man. Hey. I don't want it. Hey, come on, it's just man. It's bad writing. Yeah, I mean, we could write a better horror <laughs> movie than that. Really? You think we could? Absolutely. I'm as creative as the first spider to spin a web. Hey, you know how we always dreamed about having a house that comes out of our butts? Uh, what? Huh? Yeah, butt house. No. It would get them out of the house. Well, that's true. And I gotta do something, because they're more annoying than ants at a picnic. Would you mind turning that down? Oh! And you're not supposed to be grilling. I know you can understand me. Ah! Oh my god, I can't believe I stole this. You know what? I don't feel bad. That woman's a nightmare. <gasps> Ooh, I should text this to my best friend. Sick brooch! Adam, are you done with that mayor homework yet? It's called a bill, Mom. The fuck is a brooch? <laughs> so far, this has been a bigger waste of time than an acceptance speech at the Asperger's Awards. Asperger's? I'd like to thank everyone I've ever met in the order that I met them. Last name first, and if anyone interrupts me, I'll have to start over. Who eats Asperger's? He's becoming a star. That's right. Man, Nasty. this must be what it's like to be Anne Hathaway's parents. Gonna be malnourished eating Asperger's. Oh, that's Anne's car. Ugh. We now return to Kevin James Got Too Fat to Be in Movies. Kevin James, why'd you have to come back to television? I ate Adam Sandler. <laughs> Yoo-hoo! I'm in here with the pizza! That's funny. Man, I look ate at that. Adam Sandler. They make such a cute couple. Like Pac-Man and Ms. Pac-Man. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Nigga. <laughs> what? Of course not. We're friends. Who yeah, made no, I, that? I that's, that's, that's what I thought. And also, you bring me dead birds. 
I know Lois gets mad about it, but I like using them to point at things. Hey, did they move the bagels? Yeah, they're right there. Oh my god, what the hell is that? This? This is a pointing bird. I mean, you don't understand. Karen made me feel worse than a guy getting cut from a baseball team. You wanted to see me, coach? I'm sorry, Kyle. You can't do this boring, stupid thing with us. I don't I'm just happy baseball. you pushed me, because now I can't wait for that tournament. I know, oh, it's going to be well. great. And I already know exactly where I'm going to put that trophy. So the baby died? Yeah, ah, the baby died. Ah, but look, ah, first place. Ah, how did he get it Maybe in? we could grab lunch and then see what happens. Oh, yeah. This will not end yeah, we well by like eating an artichoke. Good Lord. I ate nothing and I'm soaking wet for some reason. Oh, yeah. <laughs> we now return to the Awkward Stepdad Show. Man, your mom's a real groaner. Do you hear that in your room? Motherfucker, what? And the Grammy for Biggest Posse goes to Ja Rule. What? No, Madonna. Posse. Posse. Oh. We now return to the Sunday afternoon movie, Masturbator and Commander. Mother f Captain, the enemy ship has opened fire on us. I'll be right out. Sir, we've already lost 10 men. Hang on. Sir, don't oh. you think we should return fire? Yeah, yeah, go ahead and do that, and I'll, I'll meet you up there in like five minutes. Oh! Meg, Meg, I promise I'll do better at this job than I did on the SATs. Oh. Come on. Do math. Awesome! I'm gonna be a famous music star like Muddy Waters! Muddy? Baby? Everything all right in there? Oh, I think I'm about to pass a kidney stone! There's no conflict in this movie. When are you going to get rid of that stump? I've been asking you for months to get rid of that stump. I'll do it, all right? Just get off my back. Oh. Yes. She's gone. We can finally be together. But, Tim, I'm rooted to the ground. We'll find a way. Finally be together? We'll find a way. You're going to stick your dick but in boy, it's... Boy, it's going to be tougher than the reviews for our American cousin. Blah, 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 Lincoln assassinated, blah, 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 tragedy for our republic. Uh, oh, look, ably performed by the entire ensemble. Ably that's performed. all, that's that all of us. Is. Yep, that's me, I did Randy that. Randy Fulcher used to pants me every chance he got. Oh, ew, who My pants is a dude? My is on the giving tree. Gay, Nerd. that's gay, that's gay. <laughs> Randy. Nerd. <laughs> Any dude that does that, just accuse him of being gay. Nerd because he wants to see Randy. your ball. That'll make him stop. Ow, damn it, Peter, oh. stop it. I gotta tell you, you're pissing me off worse than when I watched the OJ verdict with my old roommate. We, the jury, find the defendant, Orenthal James Simpson, not guilty. Yes. What the hell? What? Maybe we should get new roommates. Yeah, maybe we should. We now return to How I Met Your Father. Oh, Barney, I'm never going to meet the right girl and get married. You know, Ted, don't you think it's kind of strange for a guy in his 20s to always be talking about getting married rather than getting laid? Barney, I'm in love with you. Motherfucker! No! Peter, ah, 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 ah! Hey, you wrong for this. You ain't shit for the last clip, and you know it. He's Brian. That's more ridiculous than the theory of why Tom Cruise runs in all his movies. Wow, that cameraman has nice, strong arms. You can't catch me, gay thoughts. God, he's like a totally different person. Like Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Sulu. Oh, <laughs> oh no, I never should have drank those chemicals. <laughs> Hello. Oh, 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 I haven't misjudged yes, someone this bad since my last physical. All right. Good, The doctor good will Lord. be in, in a few minutes. Good Lord! Help! No doctor in town will see you after that lawsuit. Well, and I'll just find a doctor out of town. Listen, uh, I know I'm feel? not a regular patient, but I think I have some trouble with my prostate. So, Ugh. can you help me out, Dr. McCoy? Why is what? So, much so you can sue me, too? Oh, come on. It'll only take a sec. Forget it. Ah! I'm a doctor, not a patsy. What type of shit? Hello. Motherfuck! Yo, oh, hey, say, this you is ain't shit for this. accomplishment than getting Mini Driver's head to fit on screen. Okay, they don't mean that up. type of head, right? Further. Move back some more. What? Back up some more. 
I'm as far away as I can get. Okay, have her enter. Action. Damn it, cut. <gasps> How did she get in? She must have been quieter than Britney Spears' dietitian. E easy on those trans fats. N not everything needs gravy. <laughs> <laughs> you know, there's some carrots down at the other end. That that cheesecake was for everyone. <laughs> oh, this is an even bigger jackpot than when the Emperor figured out the formula for great Star Wars dialogue. Something, something, something dark side. Something, something, something complete. What you've done is more horrible than sex with Sharon Stone. Ooh. Wow, that was great. One minute I'm filling up at Chevron, and the next I'm having sex with Sharon Stone. Yeah, now comes the best part. <laughs> I did not see that Remember coming. Remember we tried to open that restaurant, and we never quite got it going. Yeah, we got shut down because of my exploding cupcakes. Mmm, I hope these taste as good as they look. Mother, what type of... <laughs> the secret is in the frosting. Is it? But I'll never tell. What do you mean you'll never tell them? And lately, know? this family has been lacking moral fiber. Especially you, Meg. Meg, what happened to you? She can't answer you. She can't even talk. Ever since she started smoking pot, she just kind of lays there. It's really sad. And a tiny bit funny. Oh my god, I think I'm getting a contact high. <laughs> oh, no, I messed up too. No. Nope. Brian's going to be really upset when he finds out. Eh, I'll just take him for a ride in the car. He'll forget all about it. Wait a minute. I know where we are. The park is near here. We're near the park, Lois. Oh, that's the tree. I peed on that. Hey, hey, Lois. Lois, there's another dog in that car. Hey, 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 hey. There's another dog in that car. Hey, are you seeing that? Hey, hey, hey. Other dog. F you. Oh. Get me a beer, Brian. I am going to prepare for this as thoroughly as Ben Affleck prepares for a role. Whoa, I got to be Henry VIII in 20 minutes. Hello, 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 hello. Got it. Well, why can't she go back with my dad? Well, I can't answer that. But I'm going to do my best to make her even happier than those kids on Three Wishes with Amy Grant. What's your wish, Billy? Can you cure my cancer? No, but how about if Spider-Man gives you a $50 gift card to Sears? Here, get well. It's just wrong for the military to mess with kids' minds. They're all going to wind up in therapy like Peter was. Every time my daughter opens her mouth, I just want to punch her in the face. She's really annoying. Uh-huh. All right, let's explore that. What the hell's wrong with you? Your skin's, like, moving around or something. I believe I'm having some sort of seizure. <laughs> I know! He's a visionary. Like Gandhi or Mozart or Picasso. Ladies and gentlemen, my newest work. Now, I know this person looks a little oh. mixed up, but watch carefully. If I move this down here and this over here... Probably looks like a and dude. And this part here... Oh. Anyone tell who it is yet? No? Okay, well, what if I move Michael this J. here Fox? and this here, and it's Diane Wiest. And Robert now back even... to Romancing the Stone. The only way they're not going to kill my sister is if we give them the stone. Well, they're going to be looking everywhere. We'll have to hide it in my chin. Oh, shit. Uh-oh, here they come. You better get in there, too. Oh, if I can just get her to hit me one more time, it'll give me the rush I've been looking for. Oh, no, oh, no. What's next? What's no, next? What's next? What's oh, God, next? I've been so bloody naughty. No. Oh, I need to be taught a lesson, and you're the one don't to do it. Oh, oh, thank you. Oh. Thank you. What do you mean, thank you? We now return to Japanese girls think small versions of things are really cute. Oh, look at my tiny dog. I'm going to put it in my tiny purse. <laughs> tiny phone. <laughs> tiny everything. <laughs> And another... What? Sorry, I fell asleep watching Sabado Gigante last night. Chiste <laughs> grande! Is that Super real? Superstore USA has taken all my business. Mine too. In fact, the only guy in town making any money is that guy who makes tumbleweeds. Y'all laughed at me! Y'all laughed at me! Well, who's laughing now? Hee <laughs> hee what do you think of this? That makes you attractive! Yeah! Well, I never was very good at building things. Like that time I built that handmade electric razor.
By gluing many razor blades to this ordinary desk fan, I'll save time in my morning routine. No! Lois, I done it again! Motherfucker, what? Again? Again? God, this place officially sucks worse than the WNBA. And at the top of the second half, it's 16 to 9. Easton leads the scoring with four. And that's why she commands $7,000 a year. These gals sure do make it look difficult. But is having this minor skill worth being so unattractive? That's for the fan to decide. Yay! Boy, this sounds like more trouble than a moose on the interstate. How is that? We'll do moose hey, stuff for money. Hey, can you help me out? I'm trying to get a couple of bucks for something to eat. What's moose stuff? Uh, whatever you want it to be. I could have sex with you, or I could just stand over there and drink from the lake. And everything in between. Oh my god. Get what in. type of shit? Devin, do you have a cigarette? Sure. And here's a copy of my last movie. It's essentially Brokeback Mountain from the point of view of the horses. Hey, the sun's been up for an hour. Shouldn't we get riding? Uh, are they still sleeping? Oh uh, no, I'll check. Ah! What? Ah! What? 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 what is it? Oh my god! Oh god, no. run! Oh god, run. You have we to run. We now return to cutting in line in front of Italians. Hey! Oh, hey! Oh, hey! Oh, hey! Oh, hey! Oh, hey! Oh, hey! Whoa, hey. Whoa, hey! Copernicus, why don't you navigate yourself to the back of the line with your feet and stand there with your shirt? Oh, Stewie, it's wonderful. This is going right up on the fridge. Really? The fridge? It's like we have a little Michelangelo in the house. Okay, see you guys later. <laughs> I almost lost it when you said to put it on the fridge. I know. I mean, what the hell is it supposed to be? A pelican or a school bus? <laughs> Looks oh. like Muhammad Ali drew this. <laughs> what, what a dumbass. <laughs> hey, let's spit on it. Oh! <laughs> Damn, my brother. Well, we're not the first people to be dragged off against our will. Are we there yet? No. Are we there yet? No. Are we there yet? Damn it, I swear to God, I will turn this ship around. That works. Okay. Can we teach us a lesson? Yeah, that's even better. Well, All right, lesson, if that's yeah. what you want, I'm in that. that. And now back to Roundtable with Al Michaels, Harold Ramis, Ray Romano, and Kermit the Frog. These zoning laws are infringing on the uh, rights of citizens. If I might interrupt for a minute, I'd like to point You've out You've had that your time. Let someone else I speak. haven't said a word. It was that guy. Don't look at me. I can't get a word in edgewise. Well, then who the hell's been talking this whole time? Oh, well, that's a hard question. I don't Forget it. I've missed too many other opportunities. There he is. Took you long enough. Just what we need. Hey, guys, I'm coming in. Oh, oh, God. oh God. Oh, Worst boy. Person. I am Worst not going to hear ever. the end of this. You jackass. No, you done it, this. idiot. I know I don't fit here, but I'm just going to settle right in. Punch him right in his face. Like yesterday, I Gotta started a lovable gang of Cockney pickpockets. All right, boys, the best targets are old rich people. Here's one now. Go get him. Oh, no. There's no police here to help me. I hope you don't find the money strapped to my thigh. He can't be dead. There's got to be something I can do. Maybe I'll bury him in the pet cemetery. <laughs> okay, I'll bury him in a regular cemetery. These Texans are socially backward, and politically they're all stubborn as a mule. Nope. Sorry. Kevin Bacon wasn't in Footloose. What? Of course he was. No, he wasn't. You lose. Of course he was. He was the star. Nope, he you're wrong. Look it up. I don't have to look it up. It's common knowledge. Nope. He was on the nope. cover of nope. People magazine nope. when the movie nope. came. He, everyone nope. knows Kevin nope. Bacon was a star nope. of Footloose. No, nope. it was nope. a huge movie. Nope. He was the nope. lead. No, 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 no. Come on. Come on in. Your family's waiting in here. There are toys and a puppy and food that's not served from warming trays. <laughs> Oh. Come on, oh. you gotta want it. You gotta want it, buddy. Oh, you, gotta you gotta do better than that. You gotta do okay, better than that. Okay, I guess you don't want a new family, toys, and a puppy. <laughs> <laughs> we are gonna raise more hell than Hellraiser. There's no way you raise more hell than Hellraiser. Hey, bro. honey, you want some salt for your steak? Yeah, sure. Ah, <laughs> gotcha. That's more salt than you wanted. Remember those sweet, warm New England summers? I remember remember sipping lemonade underneath a shady tree? Lemonade. Remember when you hit that pedestrian with your car at the crosswalk and then just drove away? Pepperidge Farm remembers. But Pepperidge Farm ain't just gonna keep it to Pepperidge Farm self free of charge. 
Maybe you go out and buy yourself some of these distinctive Milano cookies. Maybe this whole thing just disappears. We now return to Rodney King of Queens. Rodney, did you take out the trash? Oh, uh, I forgot. I'm looking at the camera like this when that Pepper's Farm dude was doing that skit because I want to tell y'all a story, but it's very self-incriminating and I can't tell y'all. So I just got to look at y'all and hope y'all can't read my brain. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, no, she didn't. Besides, yeah, it's bound man. to go better than my deep sea training. Well, we got a long time in this decompression chamber. Uh, you guys mind if I turn on a radio? Peter, don't! Oh, nice going, oh, Jack. Oh, look what you did. Oh, hey, oh, hey, 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 the hell this. out of me for trying to brighten your day with music, hey, all right? You, you idiot, use your brain. You, you, you're an idiot. Oh, ah, hey, oh, hey, oh, oh, hey, oh, hey, oh, 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 hey, oh, 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 Stop, 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 stop. Oh, man, we're gonna need some butter or something. Because I'm your son, and I'm tough. I made it halfway through failure to launch. I just never managed to get my life together. <laughs> Isn't that hilarious? <laughs> You're cute. Done. I'm more of a sellout than you were when you did those Butterfinger commercials. Nobody better lay a finger on my Butterfinger. Do. Come on, Lois. Sometimes kids can be a handful. Look at Gregory Peck's kids. Are we there yet? It's crowded back here. Stop touching me. Your leg is rubbing up against mine. Hey, quiet down or I'm pulling over. Stop breathing on the window. You idiot, that's condensation. It's on the outside. That's it. I will come back there and so help me God, I will hit you with my ring hand. <laughs> oh man, this is gonna be great. Oh, are we watching a movie? The lab results are back. You've tested positive for nymphomania. Oh yep. no! What should I do? Take two of these and call us in the morning. Well now that's not going to help her nymphomania, it's only going to exacerbate it. For the rest of my life I'll be as lonely as Pat Robertson and Jerry Falwell after the rapture. Damn it, Jerry, why are we the only ones still here? I don't know, we hated all the right things. Now there's nothing left to hate. I'm gonna hate that rock. No, I'm gonna hate that rock. Let's both hate that rock. I hate you. I hate you too. Motherfucker! I hate you! This is the greatest show I've seen in years. Not like the last time I was at a comedy club. I hear this guy's hilarious. He played Kramer, you know. Oh, this is gonna be fun. To swap my vocal cords with Patrick Stewart. Hey, Lois, I spent the afternoon making a list of famous Armenians. Eric Bogosian, Andre Agassi, Jerry the Shark Tarkanian. That is all. You'll be kept as healthy as a horse. So, how's that leg doing? Uh, great, great, never better. Good. Why don't you try putting some weight on it? Uh, sure. Yes, yes, oh, that's good. That feels good, very strong. Sorry, Thunder, I gotta put you down. Huh? How's your oh. leg? You ready to race? Huh? Oh. Alright, don't freak out, Peter. Don't freak out like you did when your goldfish died. Here you go, Lieutenant Shiny Sides. It's okay. You don't have to eat it now. You're just sleeping. You'll eat it later. You'll eat it later, Lieutenant Shiny Sides. Ah. I'll testify against you just like I did against Michael Jackson. Stewie, did Mr. Jackson behave inappropriately toward you? Well, yes, but the worst part was he never called back. <laughs> <laughs> no, but uh, in all seriousness, yeah, he was actually pretty aggressive. Face it, Brian, she's dumber than a Boston area book report. The novel I chose to address is Oliver Twist by Charles Dickens. Queer name, right? The book was actually not bad. No. Nope. I'm entitled to these things, Lois. Especially after I got shafted by that Asian Santa at the mall. Never get what shafted. What you want? What you want for Christmas? Um, I was thinking maybe one of those old-timey... Too late! Take too long! Sad uh -oh. Christmas! Uh -oh. What you want? Fire truck! What color? Red! Next! Ah. Peter, this is more irresponsible than when you fed your mogwai after midnight. Peter, didn't the little Chinese man tell you not to feed him after midnight? Oh, come on, Lois. He's so cute. And he's hungry. What could happen? <laughs> Hello, I'm Fran Drasha. Ah, kill it, kill it! Oh my god. It's more disgusting than when you gave me that Christmas gift. Oh, what is it? A little birdie? Uh, oh my god, it's dead! Brian! Oh, oh, Brian, this is disgusting! Oh my god, get it out of here! 
Right here. Drink the I'm, rainbow, I'm sorry. Bitch. I thought I thought you'd like it. Brian, I love it. I'm gonna call you Sticky Head. I love you, Sticky Head. This is weird in that rap video by MC Escher. Going up the stairs and going down the stairs and going up the stairs and going down the stairs and going up the sideways stairs. Look at all these Hummers. What kind of jerk would drive one of those? Dude, this car kicks ass and I can watch Madagascar while I'm driving. What kind of music do you like, Loria? Hippo hop. Woohoo! Yeah, baby! <laughs> Dude, those animals are so funny, they make me want to merge without looking. Okay. Oh. Yeah, Rumsfeld! What? <laughs> That's terrible. Uh, no. No, no, ah. Uh. Yeah. No, ah. Uh. Uh, this is even worse than when you ate that bubblegum out of the garbage. Brian, did you get into the garbage last night? Uh, no. Why? Don't lie to me, Brian. I'm not lying. <laughs> We now return to America's Next Top Model. I, I just don't think you're being fair, Tyra. You, you don't know what it's like to grow up the way I grew up. You know what? How dare you? You don't know me. You have no idea where I come from, where I've been, how long I've been there, what I had to do to get from where I was to where I am now! Oh, oh! Oh, didn't see that coming. Ooh, that's got to hurt worse than getting a birthday telegram from Zinedine Zidane. Who the hell is that? Yes? Oh, my God. Bon anniversaire. What did she do? Don't worry, Lois. All he needs is an after-school activity to get his mind off the army. Just something to distract him. You know, like all of America gets distracted whenever a cute white girl dies. We regret to report that not all the children on board the school bus survived. We have identified the body of one victim, nine-year-old Becky Gunderson. Oh. No, wait. That's uh, Becky Gutierrez. Oh. oh. That's not news. Ugh, this is going to be more painful to watch than when he ate half a fudgesicle in one bite. Oh, boy, a fudgesicle. <laughs> boy, that's even kinkier than the porn they make for senior citizens. Can I help you, Edward? Yeah, I'm here for the early bird special. Are those new slacks? What's that now? Are those new slacks? I got these on special at Caldor. Caldor. Who drove you there? My nephew. Ah, oh, that was nice of him. Was it? I forgot why I came over. Are those new slacks? Are those new slacks? <laughs> I never got to be wild. Except for that time I rode the mechanical bull at that bar. Look how much fun I am! Oh, great. This is gonna be worse than the time I lived with Marley Matlin. Hi, Stewie! Oh, come on, Marley. I know you can't hear them, but you gotta feel those things slapping out of there. Yes, you'll be about as effective as the Wizard of Oz was at granting wishes. And, Dorothy, you wanted herpes. But little did you know, you've had herpes all along. I didn't want herpes. Oh. Well... You've got it. <laughs> Besides, it sure beats the hell out of last Saturday when we partied with that big horn guy from Legend. Hey, you guys want to go to IHOP, get some breakfast or something? Oh, God, I don't know, big horn guy. It's like 3 a.m. Oh, that sucks, man. I'm wide awake. Hey, Quagmire, you want... Ah! 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 Oh, my God, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, man. Are you okay? No! I didn't see him. Ah! Superstore USA has their own paper route. That new paper boy done gone and broke my sternum. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. At least he went to sleep. Come on, it was only 600. My God, that's more than I spent to go see that prize fight in Vegas. I thought you said we was going to see Hairspray. Bitch, I thought I said just shut up and be looking fine. Yeah, that's boring. Point. I want you to do something more interesting, like when I had that job feeding the homeless. That's going to make you big and strong. Burping time. Oh, smells like someone needs to be changed. When was the last time you were changed? Seven days ago? That's one week. There are seven days in a week. 
I love you, filthy hobo. He's the jerk in all this. Like Dick Cheney when he was a Walmart greeter. Go f yourself. Go f yourself. Go f yourself. Yeah, she's all smoke and mirrors. Just like Harry Houdini. But I don't want to play bridge with the Petersons tonight. Harry, we agreed weeks ago and we're going. All right, fine. Let me get my coat. Oh, wait a second! Damn it! I am not going by myself! Ah, you bitch. Oh. Hang on to something, because this ride's about to get rougher than dating a hot girl with a bad laugh. I really like you, Sandy. I really like you too, Peter. Yeah? You like it when I kiss you here? <laughs> yeah. How about here? <laughs> <laughs> oh, stop, I'm too... <laughs> We now return to Laguna Beach. Like, right? I know. Whatever, because duh. I know, right? Whatever, because I mean, like, totally full out. Full on. Right? Okay, you can stop here. There's no way that microwave costs more than 300 bucks. Stop here. Don't, don't listen to that fat tourist. She doesn't know how much a microwave costs. Stop! <laughs> we should have gone to Plinko, like Cleveland. <laughs> Oh. Jeez, Meg, you always gotta ruin my good time. Just like basic cable. We now return to Showgirls. Yeah. On TBS. Ah. Uh. Oh. In other pseudo-scientific news, a local man claims to have spotted Bigfoot. We've got the exclusive interview. I was about to bone my girlfriend out at the lake, but suddenly she yelled, so I looked up and it was Bigfoot. So what happened next? Then I went back to bone her, but the mosquitoes were going crazy, and she said there was no way. We now return you to Native American What's Happening. Hey, rerun. You see Dwayne? Not today. Oh, here he come. How, how, how? Oh, yes, I'm sure it'll go as well as Liza Minnelli's Playboy shoot. Oh, God! Please put your clothes back on! Mama! Mama! Do you love me now, Mama? Oh. Please love me, Mama. Like that foreign guy at work who helped me understand sarcasm. <laughs> nice day we're having. Oh, yes. What? He said nice day, but he covered with rain. So? So he said this when your brain no, it's not really nice day. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yes, he said the opposite. It's funny. Oh, yeah, I, I get it. Nice day. Oh, now you funny too. Oh. Well, I know the people will support you, Lois, because you connect with them. Like Disney connects with its audience. You to cow! No, you to cow! Wow, Disney gets us! Ugh, some days I think it was easier being Cubit's roommate. God, it's all night with this guy. Hey, if you're gonna leave all those lights on, I'm not gonna split the electric bill. Perhaps one day I could be more powerful than King Friday. I am the supreme ruler of the neighborhood of make-believe. All will kneel before my... Ugh, what kind of freaking king lives next to the train tracks? What is this, Mexico? Oh. Joe, you got this all wrong. Like God did when he made Rosie O'Donnell. Oh. You can't put a vagina on this man. Oh. Why not? I'm God. Oh. Well, what do you want to do about the breasts? Uh, take a couple out of the bin we can't find matches for. You can't put a vagina on that man? Uh, you Joe, him? you are going to be happier than bullfrogs on vacation in Ethiopia. Oh, this is fantastic. This is even better than they said it was in the brochure. Oh, yeah, I feel like a pig, but come on, we're on vacation. Exactly. Right? Don't hate yeah. yourself. We're on vacation, exactly. right? Yeah, I hear Madonna's raising this guy's kid. Oh. Are you serious? We come to a mansion and you want to live with the help? Ugh, that's like going to the a strip help? club on a Tuesday afternoon. You gotta go on a Tuesday. Is there anyone here who hasn't had a C-section? Oh! This party's worse than a Mexican funeral. Es con mucho dolor que digamos adiós a Javier, y Pepe, y Carlos, y Lupe, y otra Lupe, Salvador, Fabián, Jesús, María, Vincente, y los perros de Vincente. I don't know how to tell you this. 
But you weren't born in America. You were born in Mexico. What? <laughs> when I found out that your real father was a drunken Irishman, I went to Mexico to terminate my pregnancy. <laughs> but God oh! had other plans, oh! and you were born right there. You were so beautiful, oh. and I loved you. I'm free now. I've got my own place, no attachments. There you are. That's just the kind of can-do spirit that built this nation. We hold these truths to be self-evident, that all men are created equal. Except the Jews. Franklin, for the fifth time, I'm sorry you overpaid for your house, but it's not going in. You'll be sorry. Noted. Moving on. You know, he wrote all those Kentucky Fried Chicken jingles. I don't care for them. Not after what happened to Foghorn Leghorn. I say, I say, son, what, what do we got brewing in here? I was walking by when I picked up the smell of eleven herbs and spices. Oh my God! <laughs> hey, look at that boy running all around like a chicken with his head cut. Wait a minute. Well, by God, Brian, we're murderers. I guess this means you'll be going to doggy hell. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> I haven't been this disappointed since I saw the lake house. See, the mailbox is like a time portal. Everything Keanu Reeves puts in there, Sandra Bullock gets two years later. Oh, my Hickory Farms package is here. Mr. Superman, no here. Uh, well, we're looking for a missing... I know. Mr. Superman, he, he no is here. Yeah, okay. Well, uh, can you just give him this flyer? I no, No. I have no money. Just take this flyer, and if you see this baby... No, no. Yeah, that's a great achievement. Just like the first chemotherapy patient to figure out the handkerchief look. Honey? Get in here! What is it? Just, just get in here! What? Oh my god! Right? It's like you don't, don't even, even have, have cancer. cancer! I know! Oh my god! <laughs> no, but I still have pretty aggressive cancer. Still have pretty aggressive cancer. We right? now return to Damn Nature, You Scary! Damn on Nature, BET. You Scary! Damn, look at that son of a bitch go! He hauling ass! That thing come by my house, I kill it! <laughs> that little rat looking thing just got ate! Damn, nature, you scary. Pina, why would you do that? Because Speedy Gonzalez is an immigrant and a bad influence on our children. That's so racist. I created his American equivalent, Rapid Dave. And they got seizures. I got you now, mouth. Yeah, well, up yours, cat. Quickly, 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 run fast, run fast, quickly. I hate shows that cut away from the story for some bull crap. <laughs> Ah, uh, now see, that's an even more beautiful sight than 72 virgins waiting in heaven for a suicide bomber. No. Here I am! We're playing Magic the Gathering. Wanna join? Osama! Well, I think you've been wonderful. Like when you took her to that new movie, I'm rich and you're poor, but let's dance together? I'm rich and you're poor, but let's dance together. Society won't like it. I don't care. Good for you. Good for you. Real good. Boy, great party, huh, Fred? Yeah. You know, Bon, I figured I ought to tell you this. I was walking by your house the other day, and uh, I poked my head in the window, and Betty was undressing. Uh, she saw me there, but she didn't stop. What? She didn't stop. I mean, she saw me there looking at her, and she kept undressing. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Are you serious? Yeah. I got an erection. No more will I treat you like some kind of alien. Safe distance. Stop. Not so fast, y'all. You think you can just up and run away? You crazy. I like to eat people from other planets. Especially y'all. I like to eat you with my little mouth, too. Oh, now y'all get back up inside me, little mouth. I wants to play, too. Get back inside. I'll get you when we's eating them. Zoop. And you'll be cooler than a mid-80s novelty answering machine message. I'm glad you called, but I'm not home. But I'll be back before too long. You gotta wait for the beep. You gotta leave your name. You gotta leave your number. Wait for the beep. It's me again. I just had to hear it one more time. That was a good answer. And now back to One Tree Hill. Dude, let me tell you something. 
There is nothing that'll ever happen in the rest of our lives that's as important as what's going on right here, right now, in high school by these lockers. I've really? got so many problems. Hey, nothing that can't be fixed by staring at a lake. High school is such a serious thing. These problems matter. Great. Nigga. This is a bigger waste of time than Ringo's songwriting. Hey guys, I wrote a song. Oh, that's great. Oh, good, Ringo. Fantastic. You know what? I'm gonna put it right here. Right on the refrigerator. That way we'll get to see it every day. All right. Yeah, she looks worse than Andy Garcia when he had his conjoined twin. I had a great time with you tonight. You're really amazing. Thanks, Andy. I had a great time, too. Hey, how about some love for Shoulder Guy over here? <sighs> Shoulder guy wants to get in on this. No, Just bro. ignore him. Okay. So, do you maybe want to go in the other room? Sure. Sounds good. Oh, and shoulder guy's going with you. Rick, shut up. Hey, bitch, want to suck on my tooth? Goodbye, Tin Man. Goodbye, Dorothy. Goodbye, Lion. Goodbye, Dorothy. And I think I'll miss you most of all, Scarecrow. Oh, okay. Kind of an odd thing to say. Yeah, sort of a weird comment right in front of all of us. Kind of yeah. thought this was a team effort. Yeah, yeah, really, really glad I risked my life and everything. Yeah, it's... you're like five minutes from gone and you leave with that? Yeah. You know, that's like cutting a huge fart and then walking out of the room. And that's how we'll remember you, as a big fart. Goodbye, big fart. I've screwed up worse than Disney did when I cast Michael J. Fox in that Zorro remake. Who was that masked man who saved us? I don't know, but he left his insignia. Oh! And I can't rent movies anymore. Uh, yes, I'd like to rent this copy of Garden State. Okay, I'll just need a picture ID. Oh, I don't have one. I'll rent it then. Man kills Sif after watching Garden State. <laughs> it could have been me. This Tuesday on Lifetime, Valerie Bertinelli stars in a Lifetime original movie. You know, Doctor, you said you were going to cure my cancer, but all you did was rape me. I'm starting to think I don't have cancer at all. Well, you're right about you're the welcome. rape part, but I'm sorry, you still do have cancer. <laughs> Sex will cure it. in Men Are Terrible and Will Hurt You Because This Is Lifetime. Yep, hey. What do you want your alias to be? What are you talking Holy about? Fuck. I'm not going to... Pick a name for yourself! Willem Dafoe. No, not that one. I used to have a Willem Dafoe living under my bed. Dun, dun. Hey, you asleep yet? Uh, no. Just checking. Aw, oh, that man's up to no good. I never realized until now how much I've taken her for granted. I mean, she's my only daughter, and I feel like I've never treated her as well as I should have. Hey, Meg, you got something on your shirt? <laughs> oh. Hi, Dad. Oh, my God. Where'd you get these? Craigslist. Boy, that's got to be some long list. And pool tables and jukeboxes. Craig, are you getting all this down? Yes. Is that it? Oh. No. Futons. Everyone's Futons. grandfather's everybody's, golf clubs. Everybody's golf it? clubs. No. Gay sex. What kind? All of it. All of the gay sex? All right, fine. But you have to be careful. Don't worry. He won't have any idea. Not I'll all of it. more discreet than a guy standing by himself in the ocean. Hey, are you peeing? No. Are you pooping? I'm just trying to enjoy the day. Why don't you go bother that guy? Day. Summer's blown by, huh? No. You never, never beat your Feels meat. real good to be a veteran. Into Even better water. than buying a bottle of Newman's Own. This makes me a good person. Definitely makes you a good person. Hey, someone just bought a bottle of bland salad dressing. Now we can use all proceeds to do jihad stuff. <laughs> Maybe this is a charity you don't know. In huh. fact, we're so successful now, we have to make one of those sappy investment commercials. Thanks to my investments, I've watched my money grow. And my little girl. Dad, thanks for making my big day possible. Don't thank me. Thank Fidelity. Okay, I'm ready to marry you now. Wait, what? No, I'm your dad. Yes, you are. This is what's happening. <gasps> Fidelity, we're there for you when your baby marries his dog dad. <laughs> Does David Ortiz look just like the mom on Good Times? Oh, Peter, that's racist. No, no, look. That is racist. 
Okay, that's not racist. That's just the truth. I take it back. That's not racist. That's just accurate. We now return to Vetter Call Saul. Hey, Saul. Got into a little trouble and I'm gonna need a lawyer. Hey, yeah. Okay, so tell me exactly what happened. I was driving, had a bitch of drink, and then I ran into a milk truck. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Were you on drugs? Ian Blow Ha ha! I'm getting you a nanny. Well, I guess it would be good to have some help with Meg and Chris. And Stewie nice if he's help. ever found. They lost Stewie? Honey, do you think that's the goat and baby from the Amber Alert? Uh, the Tercel, but I don't think it's the right year. No. Nope. Did that goat steal a baby? But how? You died from a fire started by your MILF on a shelf. Want to see some pictures of my teenagers? No, Karen. Look, I haven't watered my Christmas tree for a few weeks now, so could you watch your really long cigarette, please? Did I tell you I went to the mall with my daughter and an employee thought we were sisters? Yes, many times. We'll be right back after these turn-of-the-century messages. <sighs> Another dull night at the Gentleman's Club. What we need is some room-temperature gin. Hello, gents. Fancy some room-temperature gin? Shut up, you slag. No women allowed. Room-temperature gin. Drink it without women, have an eel pie, then go to bed. Never drink it without women. I don't know what the eel yeah, pie is either. Yeah, Toshi, no Nikkei no Chojshi wa... Masaka. 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 What's going on with Nikkei? Nani moe wa nakate yo. you guys i was talking you know there's more to life than just what's on your phone no wrong idiot nope wrong idiot uh, emergency alert from anyone I know how to turn these things off bro tell me if you do we're going to trade it for mort and collect our money uh, and i also ordered an extra slice of pie because you know how many times we live brian once <laughs> once <laughs> uh. watson this is the boat to america how do you know that? Because Neil Diamond is on board. Look! September morn. We danced until the night became a brand new day. I really hoped he'd be singing America. For every dollar I make, one goes to me and one goes to charity. I'm gonna rent a Ferrari and cruise the pier. You want in? Well, cancer's not going anywhere. No! I'm sorry, Billy. You're one dollar short of being able to afford the surgery you need. Sweet. I know those guys. No. Nope. Because I can't do this anymore. My life is over. I tried to adjust, but it's impossible. Come on, Quagmire. It's not impossible. You want impossible? Try eating local pizza with a guy from New York. You call this pizza? We do here, yes. I haven't heard a guy's booming fart the whole time I've been in here. I feel more relaxed than a chick on Facebook with her legs in front of a pool. No. I thought that said so geo. We now return to Captain America, Civil Union. All right, Captain America, we have to get ready for the big fight with the other heroes. Who do we have on our side? Well, Hawkeye, we've got you, Scarlet Witch, the Falcon, and, of course, Randy. Who's Randy? You know Randy, lives in my guest house. We've been friends since college. He's my pal. He's the guy I went to Paris with. You are such a coward. Randy! Cleveland, did you know about this? Come on, Donna, let's pick up some gizzards and fried skins and head on down to the juke joint. Tonight, it's gonna be jumping. Yeah. And it was <laughs> jumping. It really was. But I was banished to the sidewalk because I called one of the band guys a bad name. Yes, just look at our great city bustling with activity. Even the chimney sweeps are hard at work. It's all dirty in here. I don't care. Keep going. Shouldn't I wear some sort of protective suit? Why? Don't you trust me? No. Nope. I do. But our friend Bartholomew went in lots of chimneys in the 80s, and nope. now he's sick. Yep. Nope. Too many chimneys. We now return to the Olympics. Ugh, it's so annoying. They always use football announcers for events they know nothing about. The players are ready to take the swimming field. And they're swimming! My they appear to be doing field. the forward stroke. My neighbor has a pool. I'll take a dip if I know they're on vacation. It's neck and neck, and it looks like Canada won! Oh, yep. no, they're going back the other way. They're going back the other way. Yeah. You're just jealous. Well, let's go to her place, and I'll show you. Oh, oh sorry. my God. Sorry, today was y'all's cleaning day. 
Y'all want me to come back later? Maybe, maybe, yeah. Maybe, maybe another day. That's fine. I'll pull out. Just go easy. It really hurt on the way in. Ow, 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 ow. You don't understand what that penis meant to me. We did everything together. Yep. Absolutely everything. Everything. As she tenderly unlaced her silken corset, Jennifer shuddered in anticipation of... Wow. The sensual night ahead. That was nasty shit. You, you sure you do that? this? Oh, hell yeah. When I commit to something, I go all the way. Like when I had Kathleen Turner's voice. Good morning, guys. Peter, what's wrong with your voice? I got punched in the throat at the clam last night. Now I sound exactly like Kathleen Turner. I'm just gonna get my stromboli. Hey, get away from my stromboli, Kathleen Turner. Nah. Go ahead. I'm fine by myself. I'll just watch my Patrick Swayze movie and take a two full bath. Aw, now I want to be on that side. Oh. Well, that didn't work. Now to take a slidey toilet seat soaking wet dump. Wow, you fellas would really watch this place for me? Are you kidding? Running a bar is my dream. Well, that and waking up a rooster. Enjoy the rest of your Saturday. From now on, if you want to tweet something, you do it the old-fashioned way. Write it on a piece of paper, staple it to a bird, and throw it out the door. Oh, my God! Hey, do you follow Peter Griffin on Twitter? No. Why? Is he funny? No, he just throws dead birds on his lawn. It's awesome. I told you we could have a fun time, just the two of us. Fun's not over yet. <laughs> Come on, let's get in the trunk. I filled it with water so we can do it hippo style. Weightlessly, with my feet lightly scraping the bottom. What type of shit? Okay, it's kind of sexy, I guess. And in a hippo tradition, first we must eat a whole head of lettuce. And you have the lettuce? I, I didn't know we were doing this. Did you bring the lettuce? Oh no, I forgot. Ronald, I asked you to do one thing. Honey, honey, I brought the lettuce. Man, she is something else. This must be how Ronald Reagan felt about Nancy. Nancy, will you make me the happiest man in the world by turning a blind eye to the AIDS crisis and ineffectually trying to warn young people about drugs? Yes! Oh, yes, Ronnie, yes! If you're too young, those are both things she did. Word? I don't know, Stewie. If you ask me, the stock market's just a rigged game where the top 1% make out like bandits and regular people get hurt. Are you reading off a teleprompter right now? No. Uh, the prompter's down. What do we do? Brian, vamp. So, great to be in Quahog, Rhode Island today. That's why he's the best. You're right. Maybe I will give it a shot. Yeah, how awkward can it be? Can't be worse than waving at someone who doesn't wave back at you. Yeah, that's awkward. No, not you. Oh, sorry. In fact, everyone but you. Hi, everyone but him. Hi. Hi. Compared to the Navy, the Coast Guard is totally unprofessional and incompetent. Like that ancient Roman intern. This is Marcus. Today's his first day. He's going to be crucifying you now. He might want to use his hammer. Uh, sorry. I'm so bad at this. Relax. You're doing fine. I ain't getting crucified. Damn not. I've never been to a millennial funeral. Yeah, it seems in poor taste that they hired Keyboard Cat. Oh! Some people say we're just a computer simulation run by a higher species. Is that true? It is. My guy sucks. Want to trade guys for a little while? Oh, never mind. I'll stick with this pile of crap I already have. Oh. Ah, the ladies' room at Wimbledon. This must be the fanciest bathroom in the world. Uh-oh, looks like these are in use. Oh. Ooh. Ah. 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 Oh. Oh. Damn, bitch. Deuce. Bitch. Deuce. <laughs>
Oh my god, maybe he did do it. You know, there are some bad people in this world. Hey, you don't gotta tell me that. I learned that in Fight Club. All right, Stewie, what's the first rule of Fight Club? G-string underwear. No, it's don't talk about Fight Club. Oh, well, I really blew it. No! Peter, we have dinner with my parents that night. It's my mom's birthday. You have to be there. Lois, if you let me out of this, I will go to Meg's ballet recital in your place. Deal. Don't lie to me. I did not go to the recital. Well, maybe we were in over our heads. Like an announcer who knows nothing about his sport. He's got about 190 yards to the hole. Looks like he's going for his five iron. And those greens are playing very fast, so he's going to have to use caution on his approach. Yeah, yeah. Jordan Spieth, of course, having a great tournament. He birdied this hole yesterday. Is that right? Wow. And he hits a great shot right on the green. Yeah, yeah. How, uh, how do you win golf? Lois, I've seen enough. You're completely overwhelmed, and you have four children. <laughs> 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 four children. Hey! <laughs> you belong to a woman. How can you tell? It's hard to explain, Watson. Women are mysterious. But don't ask me. Ask contemporary personality Oscar Wilde. I prefer a man with a future and a woman with a past. Oh, splendid. Well said. Splendid. All right, let's get out of here before we're all arrested for the crime of bum fancy. No bum fancy. Also, ah. my band is playing tonight at an inconvenient time. It's six unshowered guys and a pale woman with a ukulele shouting hey in unison. Because that's what music is now. Hey! What is this? They just keep saying, hey. I know, it's my favorite song. Eh, I get where he's coming from. That's why I never introduce you to my friends. What friends? Like the guys in my photography club. Dear Gary Glitter, Jeffrey Jones, and Jared from Subway. I feel like I'm the only one sending pics. I love all the positive feedback, but maybe you guys send a pic? Anyway, here's more pics. Yeah, I decided we're going someplace nice this time. Not like last year when we went to the Outback Steakhouse. But it's out, as in the gay way. We'll no. get to the specials, but first, I need to tell you, I'm gay. The hell you are! No waiter of mine is gonna be gay! Peter, please! He's our waiter! He's the only waiter we have! Lois, our waiter is dead to us. We have to focus all our attention on our hostess now. He, he just needs a little time. <laughs> Scott. I'm finally ready to hear the specials. I'm not. Maybe you should put that off for a little while. You know, sow a few more wild oats. Oh, I've done enough of that, my friend. Especially after that raucous bachelor party trip you threw for me in Las Vegas. Every dude who says he's sowed enough wild oats hasn't sown hardly any wild oats, man. So, when do the strippers arrive? 1952. Oh. You know, just when I thought he couldn't get any cooler, he goes, holy sh Oh my god! Yeah. Oh my god! Oh, what, what? Just, there's almost nothing left of him! And I just know I'm gonna be the one to have to identify the body. That's him. Poor guy. He looks like a bowl of tomato soup. Guy next to him died in a fire. He looks like a grilled cheese sandwich. Oh, these two poor souls are the best combination for a rainy Saturday. We'll just have to roll up our sleeves and do the best we can, like the men who built New York City. Men, creating an entire subway system out of nothing is grueling, thankless, life-threatening work. But just remember, we're doing this so that one day, future commuters can be hassled by panhandlers and amateur breakdancers! What about public masturbators? Especially public masturbators! Now let's go die underground! Yeah! Great! You won't regret this. When it comes to selling drugs, you and me will be a better team than the old lady's eyeballs on Downton Abbey. I'm looking way over in this direction. And I'm looking way over here. That way we can see all the awards flying at us. Here comes one now. Best cutaway. <laughs> Shh, 
stupid Hallmark holiday anyway. Oh, hey, Bri. How's your night going? I hope Rupert and I haven't been too loud up there. Happy Valentine's Day! Oh, yeah, we're gonna go all night. What do you say, Peter? Yeah, it could be fun. And we haven't been on a date since I broke the Guinness record for longest nasal exhale at that Tina Fey movie. You're the baby mama? Well, that's no bueno. You know what, Brian? Forget it. We are done. You ruined this. We were a good team, like Ricky and the Flash. I love you, Ricky. I love you, the Flash. Stewie, I don't think that's right. Ah, I didn't see the movie. Yeah, no, I didn't see it either, but yeah, The, the Flash was the name of her rock band. Ah, oh, you saw it. Man. Yeah, I saw it. So did I. Oh. Our society is doomed. People and technology are a bad match, just like moms and Radiohead. Oh, no. No, no, this isn't music. No, I don't like this, David. No, that's enough. No, David, I don't like that. No. Okay, okay, look, I'll get a job, okay? There's got to be something I can do. It's not like I'm Ringo. Well, lads, what do you think of the new album cover? Great, but it won't look good when it's shrunk down for a CD. CD? What's a CD? A digital compact disc. Ringo, are you from the future? Yeah, and I outlive two of you. Which two? Yeah, come on, Ringo, tell us. Okay, but you all have to agree to do my song about the octopus. Hey, before you tell us, I'm gonna go and smoke a thousand cigarettes. And I'm gonna move to New York City and walk in and out of my building. Well, I'm off. Oh, Peter, I'm so worried. Where are they stationing you? I can't tell you. That is on a knead-the-dough basis. Knead-the-dough? Shh. Hey, you be safe. Now, because you can't stare at your phone anymore, enjoy a disturbingly loud clip of Jimmy Fallon on Cab TV. Tonight, get ready to lose all respect for Al Pacino when I force him to play a game meant for children! This. This is why Uber. I have milked all the goats. Peter, all those goats, goats are males. Oh my god. Well, the buckets are full and the goats are happy. I just hope oh. word doesn't get around. Oh, for a good time, call Peter Griffin. I like good time. No! No, no! I no. don't care. I'm coming with you. Well, you're not going to sit with me. Oh, no goat If sex. I don't, I'll get stuck next to that guy with the heavy hands. Hi, doggy. Just say no to goat <laughs> sex. you right. And a baby! <sighs> I can't believe I might die like this. I always thought I'd go the way all dogs dream about. Slowly and at great inconvenience to my owners. Come on, boy. Here we go. Here we go. Let's get you to the living room. Ah. Oh. Lois, wrap one of his walking to the car pills in roast beef and peanut butter. I'm gonna hold his hips while he stands confused in front of the water dish. Go on, boy. It's right there. Come on, boy. It's right there. It's water. You like it. There you go. You're doing it yourself. Nick! I'll tell you something, if he were here right now, I'd kick his ass. Just like hundreds of dead journalists, I'm not afraid of Vladimir Putin. Hello? Is it me you're looking for? Yes! I say, look, there's hotshot 20-year-old comedian Benjamin Hill. What the fuck? Oh, my God! Oh, that'll be funnier when he's older and slower. Oh, my God! <laughs> Settle down, Brian. I'm sure life will be just fine without the Internet. Maybe we can even go see that Amish comedian. Sir, where are you from? Chicago. I have never been to Chicago. How about you, sir? Boston. I have never been to Boston. Anyone here from the backfields of Pennsylvania, Ohio, or upstate New York? No. Then I have been Jebediah, son of Abner. <laughs> <laughs> Motherfucker. Listen, you need to talk to Meg about her drinking. What? Why me? Because you're the one who told her to start going to these parties. <sighs> okay, fine. I guess it's just something I gotta deal with. Like the flush of a high-powered toilet. What? Oh my god! Damn! <laughs> Edgar, do you know anything about this? What? N no. Edgar? I was at Stanley Kaplan preparing for the ACT. Well, then I am sanguine. Huh? Aha! I hope so, but you never know. They're still pretty mad at me down at Dick's Sporting Goods. Um, 
What's the name of this place? Dicks. And, and what's that say on your shirt? Dicks. Can I have two balls and a helmet? Hey, you're the guy from the phone. <laughs> Stop the car, Chris. Did you get him yet? We got him. That's a damn oh, shame. So suddenly it's a crime to break the law? Mr. Quagmire, you're free to go, but the rest of you will have to come with me. I thought we had it bad being gay overhead bins. What makes us gay? We've got bags in our mouths. Motherfuckers. <laughs> 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 bags. I wish you hadn't said that at full volume in front of our children. I can't tell if they have a really good marriage or a really bad one. I feel like it's weird but strong. Like Danny Trejo. Nick! <laughs> Thank you for noticing. Compared to him, we're about as useless as one of those automatic bathroom sinks. Yep, it really be like yep. that. Yep. 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 What the hell are you doing? This is a women's bathroom. Up. Nope. Yeah, it's awesome. Vets get all the sweet deals. I mean, you never see a homeless vet. And people have been really nice. Everywhere I go, they open doors for me. Welcome, sir. Thank you. Hey, so when really fat people come, make sure we're opening both doors. Yeah, throw that away. I don't want to go. Yep, Besides, Sunday's my internet porn night. Yep. It's my internet what? Oh, yeah. Oh, You're no. You're my Chinese Lois. No, Chinese Lois. No. There are plenty of things that are much worse for children than television. Like when Peter babysat for the neighbor's kid. Or butt sex. All right. Uh, I couldn't find your toys, so uh, why don't you just play with this blow dryer and these rattles? Yep, there you go. Yeah, guess that's it. Well, you probably want me to get out of your hair, so uh, here's the Drano in case there's a clog. Uh, soap's right there next to the radio, and towels are on the roof. So, uh, good night. Oh, hey, did they ever unfreeze Walt Disney? Uh, unfortunately. Welcome back, Mr. Disney. Are the Jews gone yet? Uh, no. Put me back in. <laughs> Don't worry, Lois, I'm good at finding people. I was the one who found Bush after Hurricane Katrina. Uh, Mr. President, are you up there? Go away! Sir, there's a disaster in New Orleans. I'm reading Super Fudge. You gotta come down and deal with this. Don't make me do stuff. Oh, man, I can't believe I'm sleeping with a model. I'm luckier than the state of Rhode Island. Well, I can't decide what to call this place. We'll flip a coin. All right, heads, Rhode Island. Tails, Cockapoopoopipishire. You're watching BBC Four. Previously on Condensation. Ellen. There's moisture on the outside of my glass. It's condensation, Johnny. But what about the fog on the windows? It's not fog, Johnny. It, too, is called condensation. Condensation. What are they doing? Yes! Ah, oh, this is more exciting than that time I got to ride the washing machine. <laughs> huh? Get the demo tickle. How we doing it, huh? You know, you really shouldn't lie on that bedspread. I saw this report on TV about how filthy hotel rooms are. In a moment, we will use the special lights to see just how filthy this seemingly clean hotel room really is. It could be worse. Yeah, no, no arguments, Brian. I already went through the trouble of borrowing this ramp from Joe. I'll see ya, honey. I'll be back in a while. Joe, are you all right? Don't help me up. I need to retain my independence. Oh, boy. You need anything from the market? Power bar! Oh, wow, I feel like an explorer. Just like my ancestor, Ponce de Leon Griffin. There it is, boys, the fountain of youth. Just like I told you. Well, that was worth the eight-year boat ride. And now back to the facts of life. Hey, Mrs. Garrett, can I ask you something? What is it, Joe? Is it a problem if your penis and your vagina touch each other? What? Well, I try to keep them separated, but uh, I woke up this morning and they were sort of together. I, I just didn't know. Is that okay? You have both? Well, yeah. Doesn't everybody? No! Oh. Wow, that sounds even better than when I got paid to take part in that study. Hmm. The only one who couldn't finish the puzzle is the fat one. I'm sorry. I can't see what you're going for here. What, uh, let me look at... Oh, it's a jar of preserves. Oh. Yeah, I guess that's what all the red pieces were. Jar huh? of preserves, man. You know? Ooh, Rupert, bad idea trusting the Celtics. Worse than when I trusted Brian to pack my parachute.
<laughs> I'm not worried about high school at all. Worst case scenario, I'll carve out a niche as the effeminate male friend of the popular girls. Okay, tonight's my OC party. I got a case of wine coolers so we can drink every time Ryan seethes. Cool, I'd love to come. Me too. How'd you get the wine coolers? No, oh, it's not. I just did some stuff for a guy in the parking lot. Does anyone have any scope? Motherfucker. For God's sakes, you're embarrassing me. Not as embarrassed as I was when I got that job entertaining prison inmates. Do it again, Griffin. Oh, come on. I just did it like five times. Do it. My milkshake brings all the boys to the yard and they're like... It's better than yours, damn right. It's better than yours. I can teach you, but I have to charge. <laughs> and now back to Blind Justice. Blind Justice. He lost his sight, but not his vision. I need you to go down to 54th and Main. Talk to the suspect's wife. While you're there, see if you can get a sample of his hair to match his DNA. All right, I'm on it. <laughs> <laughs> You know, Chris, a little hard work can do wonders. Just look at how they built the pyramids. They say all peoples must go through some hard times. Well, we Jews are getting ours out of the way early. From here on out, it's going to be nothing but smooth sailing. The Bible also says a senior citizen built an ark and rounded up two of every animal. Hey. Yeah? What the hell is this? Oh, you didn't really give any specific guidelines about mating. Did you name it? What? Did you name it? Uh, yeah, he's Paul. Yeah? Well, it's gonna be a hell of a lot harder for you now because he's going the fuck overboard. Yeah, and don't try any of your salesman funny business. Like that guy who convinced me to buy that pet Tyrannosaurus. Okay, Patches, now fetch. Oh, oh my god, oh my god, drop it, drop it, drop it, drop it. Ew, it's got spit all over it. Well, don't take it too hard. You're not the first person to get fired. Look, uh, Louis, the French people really want to thank you for your services as king, but uh, it's just not working out, and we've decided to go another way. So, yeah. Damn. Well, kids, just when I thought we'd never find an assistant coach, I ran into this drifter hanging out near the elementary school playground. He's got a clown costume in his trunk, so we know he's good with kids, and pictures of boys in their underwear, so uh, he's probably had some medical training. Well, I'm gonna take off while he fits you for cups in that windowless supply shed. See ya. Boy, Stewie's more wound up than Dad was that time he took steroids. Peter, could you please pass the potato? <laughs> ah, damn it, Meg! Damn! Stress release candles for those extra tough days at the office. Oh, you don't know the half of it. On Tuesdays, I work returns. Yeah, I bought this boom box here, and it's got this high-pitched whine. Well, let's have a look. It's yours now, sucker! Now I know how Alec Baldwin feels when he feeds his brothers. There you go. There you go. Oh! Eat up, oh! Oh! you're the oh! weakest. Oh! I haven't been this excited oh! since I learned how to speak Braille. Hey, bump, don't bump, suck no, no titty. bump, bump. Three vertical bumps, four oh, bumps man, in a square. don't never suck no titty. <laughs> yeah, I've heard they all look alike. Oh, God, I feel more delirious than my cousin, Stewie Cruz. I'm a Never breastfeed from a grown man, guys. I'm in love with Katie Holmes! I'm in love with Katie Holmes! I'm not gay! Go see my new movie! I'm in love with Katie Holmes! I'm not gay! Well, I guess it couldn't be worse than that summer I spent in India. Whatever you do, short round, don't touch anything. Okay, Dr. Jones, I no touch anything. Indy! Lady only here because she humping director. Welcome to the roast portion of the evening. Ladies and gentlemen, my son, Chris. Born on the highway, because that is where most accidents happen. Hey, da. But we're here to talk about Brian getting another year older. You know, I hear he can't even bury a bone these days without Viagra. And they say you can't teach an old dog new tricks. But I heard Brian just learned how to roll over and beg for an erection. Oh! Peter, I'm fine. Are you sure this isn't about you not being able to perform on your anniversary? I told you that in confidence! And a one, two, three. Uh-oh. Ooh. My flag's stuck in the pants. Well, get it out. We've got a show to do. Oh! Shit! You just shit on everybody. You just you just pooped on every single person. Oh, Happy shit, it's Halloween. Halloween. Can we? Oh, my God. Wow, Mayor West. Yo. That's some costume. Hey, bro. Thank you kindly. Uh, Hit her me, Borat. 
You know, from that picture of Borat. You ever seen it? Yeah. No, that movie man. came I... out like 15 years ago. Well, I'd never heard of it. But it was just about the funniest thing I'd ever seen. Nah, anyway, well, that's funny. Have a good evening. Get out of here, My bro. My wife! Don't, don't come nowhere near. Don't touch me, bro. Dr. Hartman, you said there was very little risk to LASIK, but now I am blind. How did this happen? Oh. Okay, this isn't my fault. It was take your cat to work day. Was it? It was take your cat to work? Oh, that's terrible. Oh, no. Oh, God. The skinny legs, here I come. Good morning. Are you ready to sweat? Absolutely sweat. not. Okay, let's climb this hill. I want to impress you, but also see if I can peek down your sports bra. <laughs> Ow. Ow! Ow! Ugh. My balls! No, oh, the other ones! Ow. Wow! Ow. 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 Why do you keep you doing it? I think Peter hurt his balls. I didn't hear anything. Hmm. Must have been at a frequency only dogs can hear. And you know what's right around the corner? The strip club where they spit in your face? No, the dog park. Yeah, how do you like how this sounds, huh? Try cleaning up this mess <laughs> while you burn in hell! <laughs> Peter, you ready to go? Almost. But oh, what do you mean you don't like that? Just try it. Maybe you will. What type of shit? I'm stuck up here. But he used my emergency flare. Bitch, what? We've got a flare. Bitch, what? Yeah. I'm still stuck, but now I have confidence. Wow. Man, tonight you will have one last night of peace. I won't lie to you. A hotel guest has no regard for your life. That means some of you will not be coming back. Those who do will never be one color again. Now, here are your assignments. Anderson, your late night vomit. Russell, you'll be in the ladies' room. Ooh. All right, knock it off, at ease. Edwards, you're gonna be folded into a monkey at the foot of the bed and then on. Look at Edwards, he's into it. Ooh. At ease. Oh, also, you can have my penis enlarging machine. It's in my closet. Oh! Uh, did you look? Ah. Did you text me if you looked? Ah. Man with a ah. Ah. Okay, the murderer was don't care with a ah. this game sucks in the I regret having children. Clue, you got someone pregnant nine years ago, so now you have to play this. Is it bad that I feel like they were speaking to me specifically? I've had some scares. We're not going to talk about that. Oh, you can do it, Stewie, for sure. Yep. Free your foot, and together we will bump wieners. But it's stuck, Norwegian mid-level model girlfriend. Oh, just untie your shoe is how. Oh, duh. Stewie, when will you free me from this thought bubble hell? Not for a while. I may need you if I run for office. Happy Halloween, kid. Happy Halloween! Look, it's Matt Foley from Saturday Night Live. I don't know who that is. I just came from a meeting at work. Oh, good, Peter, you're home. You can help me pass out candy. Sorry, Lois, I have to go do a dangerous speedball and become the least surprising death in Hollywood history. <clears throat> what the hell? <laughs> you're not taking this from me, bitch. <laughs> Suck it, Vaughn! I hope that mascara burns your eyes out. How's that cheap wine headache? Uh-huh. Go roll and dirt, you pig. Your hair dye stinks. Tell, Tell your, your daughter to, to stop, stop watching me change. Peter, go cut her power. Hey. Hey. Perhaps Slytherin, or maybe Hufflepuff, uh, or trans women aren't really women. <laughs> Wait, what? I mean, uh, the first two things. Uh, trans women okay, aren't really women. who's the next girl or boy? There's only those two. You're going to hate me, but I really need to take this. Don't you dare. But it might be Bruce Lee finally calling to admit that I'm the best at Kung Fu. This is your one chance, Stewie. I will not call you a second time. Damn it! I'm sick of being one-upped by Doug. Hurts. Hurts worse than a trip to the barber shop. Ah! Ah! This is what babies think happens at haircuts! Do babies really think that happens with you. haircuts? Honestly, Lois, I have no idea. My brain can't even think thoughts no more because of the internet. Uh, oh. That's it. From now on, you are an outside, Peter. Oh. Go on, get outside. Oh. Ah. 
Bitch, I pay the bills, bitch. How you gonna put me outside? Go to your Peter house. Go to your Peter house. I hope you got money, bitch, cause I ain't paying none of the bills, ho. Shit. Oh shit. Yeah, okay, we're we'll take out the camera phone. One drywall bit, one masonry bit, one spur point bit, one tile bit, one drill with a hammer action setting, one wire detector, one stud finder, and one grease pencil. Sounds like someone's drilling a hole in the wall to watch girls shower. Oh, big time. Did you pull a permit? City Hall's next. Nice. What the hell? Peter, what the hell is that? It's my new pitching machine, Lois. And look, it can turn our car into a silly tank. Watch me nail Cleveland. I got one too, bitch. You assholes. I hate that. <laughs> Peter, what are you doing? Well, you know how you told me to give up the 80s and find a whole different decade to be into? No, that's not what well, I... Well, I'm doing the 1920s. Not because of legal cocaine, but mostly because of legal cocaine. <laughs> you dirt... You piece Time of... Time to design a very stupid flying contraption. <laughs> you piece of shit. Cocaine plane! Motherfucker, what? Cocaine plane? What? Oh. What's your problem? Why are you being such a jerk to me? My problem with you? Let's see, where do I begin? You accept food, clothing, no. and shelter, yet no responsibilities. No, no, you, you constantly like that, want that, to that. sleep with my wife, who is an angel. Oh, and the hypocrisy. You claim to be an ally to women, but I bet you don't even know Nancy Pelosi's official title. Sure, who I do. Who does? She's, uh... She's a bitch. Chuck Schumer's secretary. Forget it, Brian. <laughs> Now, can you strap me to this milking table? My milking? wife will be home soon. Men don't get milk. I thought things would go back to normal after we traded underwear yesterday. <laughs> what? Don't trade no underwear, bitch. Damn, no. Fuck no. Fuck no. No. Nigga, don't. Okay, you go in there, kill Miss T, and we'll sneak out the back. You need a weapon or anything? She's a cat. I'm a dog. I'm good. So a gun. A gun. Need a gun. <laughs> Show what it is. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, world star, bitch. World star, kitten, kitty, bitch. Yeah, fuck him up. Oh, my God. Oh, you did. You It you, went poorly. You ruined your... You, giggity morning, everyone. Giggity. Lois, can I see you in the other room for a second? Sure. Gig All right. Giggity morning? Motherfucker. Peter, what would you like for breakfast? Yeah, Chocolate fast. chip pancakes. Lois, can I see you in the other room for a second? You can shoot two rounds in that fast? Damn. Oh. Oh. <laughs> That's Waffles? a... Waffles? Yeah, sure. Lois, can I see you in the other room for a second? Bruh, if you could... I, I couldn't perform a third time. Hey, happy birthday, Brian. Bonnie and I got you a big stick. Damn. Uh, Joe, isn't that the same stick we gave you for your wedding? You told me it was a magic wand. I pointed it at a bus. The bus crashed. That's all I'm saying. Well, fellas, I'm off. Old Joe's got a big stake out this week, so I'm going to practice by watching the party from across the street. <laughs> Motherfucker, what? Those who doubt the wand's power suffer the wand's wrath. What type of shit? So that's how I became Kohog's first ninja cop. Is it? Questions? Yes. Mr. Officer Haya. Did you park in the handicap spot? Ninjas don't have cars. Well, it's getting towed. There you go. Oh, no. Yep. My Chevy Cruze. Yep, your Chevy thank Cruze you. getting, thank is you. getting uh, thank towed, you. bro. Thank you, you ain't. Thank you. Huh? They, they ain't no time to thank you now. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, I can make this work. Think, Brent, think. Run really fast. Oh my god. Stewie, you got a letter from the Make a Wish Foundation. What type of wish they want us to make? Oh my god, they've accepted my application. You, you I'm gonna get my final wish granted. You handicapped? I get to meet the Philadelphia Flyers mascot, Gritty. Where, where Gritty, did you become Gritty, handicapped? Gritty, I'm not gonna pee in a cup for you, so stop asking. This was supposed to be my day, and what you're type ruining of nasty it. Nasty shit. Everybody wants to get their cup peed into nowadays. You'll Venmo me for this too, I suppose? Mr. Lloyd! What is going on in here? <gasps> oh! oh, oh. Ah! Sorry. Oh, God. Ah! Oh, shit! Come on, man. I had a very good rotation guy work on this. Can you not? 
Oh, please stop! Bitch. Sorry, sorry. I, I don't know what to say. I'll call a guy. I, I don't know. I don't Come know what on, to say. Come on, bro. Hey, Brian, check it out. Is that a person in there? This might be my biggest candy score ever. Bruh. Probably thanks to my killer costume. Must be the suburbs. What are you I'm the oh my god reaction gif. I don't get it. It must be trick or treating in the and suburbs. People get that? Yeah, everyone's dressed as gifts. Ain't that right, Pop? Have you masturbated today? That's no, not. ma'am. Well, get up there and don't come back till what's you... for dinner. Damn, your whole hey, family fast. Nigga. Maybe someday they'll make a movie about us. Y'all gonna have to practice some stamina this up in that household or something. Jungle Jim Mountain, starring Damn, Chris Pine nigga. as Doug. What? And Paul Giamatti as Stewie. Come on! Help! I crap my pants and I'm afraid of heights. I'm out of here. And Chris Hemsworth as Thought Bubble Girlfriend. I'll give it a shot. Nick! Long days, short years. Oh, Meg. Chris, masturbate! Jerk! Aw! Don't bone your sisters, man. People will never let you live it down. <laughs> Is that Bernie Sanders? Ha! Goes to Vermont once. Ah! How'd you get in here? I was propelled by a heart attack. Now let me talk about wages while the corners of my mouth fill with mung. Oh, someone at Coachella must have said my name three times. Goodbye! First, he's got to swing on the gold chains across the cologne bath without dropping his e-cigarette. Next, he's got to pick up a rideshare customer. Now he's going to be late, but he's going to make it seem like the passenger's fault and not his. Where the hell have you been? I've been here, man. Maybe you press wrong button. I don't know. Now don't talk to me. I'm on four different phone calls. Uh-oh. Stand back. The pitching machine is the only plumber we'll need. No, it's not. It's the pitching machine isn't a good plumber. The pitching machine doesn't even do it. What are you doing? At least put a condom on it first. You just shoot it all, huh? You done shot the wrong club. Oh, my God. So you're not interested in having sex with Kevin Spacey? Oh, good. Kevin's going to love that. Oh, God. Dad, Dad, I, I think I mixed up Mayor West's bag with Bruce and Jeffrey's. Leather chap. Saddle, bull whip, rope, sheriff's badges, saddle bags, saddle soap, fancy boots. Yep, this is ours. Man, both y'all gay. Okay, remain oh. calm. I've done this before. Oh! oh, oh, oh no, no, wait, no, wait, I know this. Okay, yeah. remember your medical training. Yeah. If a patient chokes on food, do the tummy squeezy move. Yeah, that, that, that's it. That is dog style. Doggy style it out. There, the whole thing. Get the whole thing in there. Oh, you, you saved my life. Yep. Oh, how can I ever repay you? Shit. Yep. Yep. Money? <laughs> ah! Money? <laughs> ah! Oh, God, these kids have their teeth. And where are their pacifiers? Oh, Will they ever sleep? Detention kids are scary. Money. Especially that fourth grader writing on the board. Homie said, money, I'm dead. Oh, that is such a load of truth. A wonderful load of truth. Juice! Juice! Should we just get him smaller shoes? Wouldn't matter. He butters his feet. Oh, sorry to interrupt. I just came to clear the search history off my computer before the IT guy... Oh, uh, he's already got it. Boy, you're really all in on Asa Akira. Most Way of off, us are. Uh, this is the only place I can masturbate. Most of I us are. put that whole detention experience behind me and just live. Whoa. Yep, they got a whole so trip that's how stamp. your granddad got his back tattoo and hepatitis. Never share a needle with Ben Affleck. How did you and other granddaddy meet? That's a story for when you're older. The kids at school were asking if you're a bottom or a top. They should not be asking that. They said if that was your answer, then you were a bottom. Who are these f 
The kids you're talking to. I know it's a word with their attractive father. Spirit Airlines is now boarding group whatever. Just start punching until you're on an airplane. Attractive father? Oh, shit. Oh, someone's Ooh. in here. That's a female. I'm not falling for this again. I'm not falling well, for can this we get again. That European exchange student I saw on TikTok. Fool me once. Yeah, I knew Hi, it. Little man. I knew it every time. Lewis. It's always a guy. Every time. Well, Stewie, you've completed your detention. What have you learned from this experience? That your mother's a whore. What? Hey, you want to end the show with a to be continued meme? I, I don't even know what that. Oh, Peter, I'm going to have to call the police on this. What? Why? It's to get our wives back to get it. Peter, these are hundreds of naked babies in suggestive situations. And they're time stamped as far back as 1998, which is way before we had this idea. Boo. I need help. Naked babies, I'm gone. Chew. Boo. Simply climb behind the wheel, drive it towards a Jew, and flatten him. Could you also use it just to drive from place to place and stuff? It's a Jew flattening machine. It's not what it's designed for. But you could use it that way. Yeah, yeah, you could. Yeah, yeah, you could, you could also use the Mona Lisa as a placemat. Always fight for what you believe in, like Patrick Henry. Give me liberty or give me death. Oh, that was easy. I know, right? Ryan wanted to give him liberty. You do the paperwork, Ryan. Where do you think you are? This isn't a doctor's office. This is the pound. You're being euthanized. What? Jess is having me put down? Oh my god, this can't be happening. Did you also eat a kid? Oh. These camps don't sound fun at all. Well, Chris, camp is only as fun as you make it. That's how it was in World War II. Don't suppose it would help to say I have a note from my doctor. <laughs> Get in there, you. <sighs> what the hell? Oh, for God's sakes, where's that white noise machine? Let me get this straight. None of you guys has ever heard of Bono. He says he knows you. Daddy, what the hell are you doing? <laughs> you throw Peter in jail? Hey, pumpkin, welcome. Whatever you do, don't tell them you have a clitoris. Yeah, they told me that at the embassy. Oh, see, laughter is the best medicine. Please, sir, I'm in so much pain. Shut up and listen to my material. Huh, what's this? Bedpan, Peter Pan. Oh, next stop is Neverland. Come, Wendy, fly with me. Ho, ho. What are you doing here? I thought you were having Thanksgiving with your parents. Chris got caught watching Cousin Katie pee, so that kind of ended things. No, I wanted to get caught. That's... it's part of it. Oh. Nice spot, huh? <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, it's great. Especially... What part of it is that? I don't... I never got that far, man. Because I... of that thing over there. You know what's in there? Corn. Really? Wow. I could go for some corn. <laughs> You're dark, Raj. I don't care. Oh, brown family. Oh, oh my goodness. I'm I'm so sorry. Sometimes I write descriptions of my patients to help me remember them. No, it's okay. Our last name is Brown. Oh, okay. Phew. Ah, then this must be Chubster Dum Dum. God, I almost didn't do it. I uh, almost didn't do it. I thought, is this in bad taste? But you know what? I went for it. I went for it, and I am so glad I did. Oh, worth it. Totally worth it. I assume you heard of the alphabet. You want to explain to me how Sammy Popsicle comes before napping various? Jeez, I'm sorry. Well, can we watch Lost Boys? I've heard of that one. Those? Those are different Lost Boys. Blind Justice. He lost his sight, but not his vision. I need you to go down to 54th and Main. Talk to the suspect's wife. While you're there, see if you can get a sample of his hair to match his DNA. All right, I'm on it. Mother... In local Motherfucker! Mother Mother run by a drunk driver today at Quahog Park. Two children are missing. <gasps> I was just there. <laughs> ah! Hey, there's that guy who got killed by a cat. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up. How'd you guys die? We bit kids. Woo! Biting kids. Yeah, unpetable. I miss biting kids. The, that uh, reminds me, I've got to send this back where it came from. Hmm. 
Hmm. Starting to think that guy wasn't a real modeling agent. And I'm starting to think that other guy wasn't a real penis butt inspector. What the hell happened to all the smart genes in this family? I mean, I invent the razor blade comb and my kids are doing nothing. I mean, when Chris grows up, will he even be able to get a job or, or take care of himself? And what's he gonna do when we die? Run! Run for our lives! Uh, yep. uh... Well, there's a new procedure that, if administered immediately, should restore his ability to walk. $200,000. We also have a wheelchair. $60. Okay. They're going with B. Well, I got the results of your ultrasound, and I got some news for you. Wait, wait, wait. We don't want to know if it's a boy or a girl. Oh, okay. Well, it's not breathing. Hey, Meg, I stood outside Planned Parenthood for 36 hours, and here are the pictures of every girl in your class who went in. All right, good. Now I want you to call them as if you're their dead baby. Oh! Yeah, that'd be great. Oh, I could use the money, and I'm getting kind of tired of my old job. Only a half a point divides our top two competitors as we enter the last event, the Meg Roll. I'm sorry, Chris. Jerome just doesn't think his daughter should date a white guy. Black racism is the biggest problem facing this country today. <gasps> ah! I, Black racism. I can't. I can't believe. <laughs> I don't know, Doctor. Looking back, I think it may have been real butter. Your husband murdered three children. Oh my God! This is so much faster than Firefox. <laughs> All right, let me go to Facebook. F A. Uh, it's auto filling, fat butt rodeo. No. Peter! Hey, you were supposed to stay on Firefox. Oh shit! Oh shit! <laughs> the Secret Service did on November twenty third, nineteen sixty three. All right, guys, I know that yesterday was a rough one for us, but it's with great pride that I'm going to turn this zero into a one. All right! Nichols, you should go home and change. That can't be good for you. Dr. Hartman said you were done with that thing. I'm not going to listen to that bozo. Of course I'm still wearing it. Watch me jump this line. Excuse me, I have scoliosis. Excuse me, scoliosis coming through. Hey, pal. Polio. A thousand apologies. I'm really, really sorry about your big noses. I'm really sorry about how greedy you are. But most of all, I'm really sorry about your dirty, underhanded, backstabbing ways. Your number one dirty Jew fan, Mel Gibson. Goodbye, friends. Goodbye, free time. Farewell, sex. So long, golf on TV. I'll miss you, privacy. Goodbye being honest about how many beers I've had. Nice knowing you, my own choices. See you later, money. We now return to the NBA on TNT on LSD. Oh, shit. Man, I'm out my mind! We now return to Meredith Baxter in Raped by a Clown. Motherfucker. It was awful. He made me do things. Awful things. What kinds of things? I don't even want to talk about it. <laughs> my post office key. I need you to go downtown and get the stuff from my P.O. box. You, you don't get your mail here? No. I get a lot of private correspondence from the Netherlands. Like what? Like, I'm part of a group that kind of trashes Anne Frank's house every year. I used to go to the library to wipe boogers in fancy books. I like to wipe mine in Bronte novels. It's like a time bomb to gross out lonely chicks. Oh, Heathcliff. Oh, come on! Oh. I want so little! Oh. I figured the day you came home with a girl, we'd have to back her through the garage. A little further, a little further, a little further. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Okay, all right. Now, do you prefer Fatty or Miss Boombaladdy? Oh, shit. Oh, my God, the president's been shot. If you ask me, the president's the lucky one. How's that? He doesn't have to sit through the rest of the show. <laughs> hey, Mr. President. Mr. President, up here. I voted for you. Wait a minute. That guy on the grassy knoll's got a gun. He's going to shoot the president. Holy smokes, I've got to do something. All right, Lee, time to become an American hero. Oh my god, you've missed so much. Like when America was attacked by mentally challenged suicide bombers. Allahu Akbar! 
Can't believe we didn't find God in Jerusalem. Well, we'll have to keep looking. Oh, here's our bus to the airport. <laughs> wow, that was super loud. You're already here. I'm sorry? Is this a good neighborhood? Uh, yeah, it's a great neighborhood. A lot of families, good parks. Hey, so sorry I'm late. Let me show you the house. No need to. Your partner already sold us on it. You should come work for me. Huh. Never thought I'd be in real estate. You think I can handle it? Bonnie, I still don't get why you want to see this house. The whole house is slanting down to that cliff over there. I just don't know if this is the right time to buy. Yeah, you're probably right. Maybe we should wait till you graduate college. Thank you, but I'm actually 42 years old. You know what? Maybe I am ready to buy. Great, I'll get the paperwork. Brian, five sales this week. You're killing it. Yeah, and last night I closed another big deal. Kim in marketing. Wow, Brian, you're doing great here. You're really on fire. The only thing is, anyone can sell a nice house, but a real star is someone who can sell a dump. God, there's got to be a sucker to buy this condo. Guys, this is on me. I just hit 20 years in the air and I got a big bonus. Looks like I found my sucker. Whoa, what? I didn't know you worked out at this gym, too. Come on, come on, you gotta want it. What's this? That is the money you loaned me. Oh, that's pretty cool. Thanks. You're welcome. Underpriced waterfront property that's guaranteed to appreciate in value. I, I don't know, Brian. I, I don't know if I'm a real estate investor. All right, guys, here it is. Prescott Towers, Quahog's premier luxury living experience. The ceiling is a pool. The ceiling is a pool. Quagmire, you gotta get this. I don't know about buying a place without seeing it first. I hate Lou Sheridan. It's Lou Sheridan. That son of a bitch! Say what you want, but he's got an eye for real estate. Let me just give him a call and let him know he's gonna get the place. Wait, 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 wait! All right, Quagmire, now when you introduce us to the ladies by the pool, I'm a millionaire, Joe's a war hero, and Cleveland is Magic Johnson. Is this the right address? This doesn't look like the building from Brian's presentation. Oh! That's probably nothing, but there's a stain on the rug in the shape of a little kid. Damn it, Brian screwed me! And that's why I've never made any major investments with my dog. What am I gonna do? Here it is. You've got 72 hours after closing to rescind the purchase. State law. Thank God. I'm still within 72 hours and I want to get out of my contract. You'd have to speak to Mr. Griffin about that, but I'm sorry, he's not in the office. If you leave your name, I'll let him know you stopped by. <sighs> Fine. Glenn Quagmire. Have him call me the minute he gets in. Close the lid. Brian, what are you doing? I'm hiding from Quagmire for a few more hours. After that, he won't be able to pull out of that deal. Welcome home. Ah, hey there, buddy. You are such a scumbag. Screwing over the people who helped you? I don't know how you sleep at night. <sighs> Even though I know you never liked me, you still helped me when I really needed it. That says a lot about your character. And that is 72 hours. Enjoy your crap, old dumbass. You son of a bitch! Oh, yeah, it's real hard being a real estate agent. I mean, you gotta be able to count bathrooms. I once beat a real estate agent in a game of chess. Hey, welcome to Bonnie's 29th birthday party. I can't keep this up. She's 46. Well, I put together some videos for Bonnie's party. Here we are on our honeymoon. Ugh, I have to text Rupert what a train wreck this is. Hey, I want real things. <laughs> Bonnie? I'm 46, and all I've ever done is take care of Joe. And now you feel like you never had a chance to be your true self. Oh, I can't believe I just kissed my friend's wife. I'm a bigger scumbag than Spock. It's that time of the year again to fulfill your community service requirement by signing up for volunteer work. Do we get to choose our own jobs? No, 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 no. I gotta tell you something. I kissed Bonnie last night. What? Don't oh, worry, no. I'm afraid of keeping secrets. Well, except for that one time you discovered my hidden shame. Peter? Mrs. Parkhurst? I'm Meg, your new student volunteer. Oh, you must be my new student volunteer. And between you and me, I hate my new student volunteer. That ugly little Meg. Oh, come on in. Peter, Joe and Bonnie are here for game night. Game night? Okay, go. 
Uh, about a boy. Uh, four, four weddings and a funeral. Notting Hill! Yes, it was Notting Hill. You haven't told anyone, have you? No, no, of course not. I, I was gonna ask if you had. Yeah, I mean, I mean, there's there's definitely some kind of connection between us, but... I felt it too, but maybe in another life, huh? Oh, there you are. Come on, Bonnie, it's Joe's turn. Okay, here we go. Uh, uh, crippled guy, uh, cheating wife. You strike me as someone who's never going to get married, that's for sure. Bitch. Now get me my itch cream. Is it in the drawer? Shut up! Ah. Damn, bitch. Here's your cream. They don't get us, Bonnie. And you deserve better than this. We both do. You know what? Let's get out of here. We did it. We don't need those narrow-minded losers. This is so exciting. We can finally live the lives we've always wanted. Hey, Bonnie, what's a five-letter word for marriage? Fraud. Uh, yeah. It's got to start with a U. Union! Boy, you stink at this. Mm -hmm. Definitely fraud. Mrs. Parkhurst? Look at you two, stealing from the elderly. You know I should call the police on you. The police? Or maybe instead we do things my way. Now I feel some dementia coming. Feed me pudding while I grip your wrist in terror. This isn't my house. Bonnie? Joe? How did you find me? Love is a powerful compass. Hey guys, I got something for you. An invitation for each of you to Quagfest. Quagfest? What's that? Sounds like fun, Glenn. Yeah, I'm closing down the whole street. It's gonna be like a block party, but with way more weirdos grinding up against your wives. And in local news, Hollywood comes to Quahog. Liam Neeson has begun shooting his latest film. All right, I'll give you the formula. My foot equals your balls squared. <laughs> Every time you get a couple of beers in you, we have to hear all about how you can beat up Liam Neeson. It's not true. Yes, it is. Hey, you know this old woman who lived in a shoe? She had so many children, she didn't know what to do. I got something she could do. Get your tubes tied, you kook. I noticed that you're one of the moms who hasn't yet signed up to be a classroom volunteer. What? I don't want you here. This is my turf. I don't bother you when you're sitting on the washing machine screaming Aaron Eckhart's name. Wow, Quagfest is a bigger deal than I thought. Oh, look, here's a simulation of what it's like to have sex with Quagmire. Now, no celebration of my 1,000th would be complete without first meeting number one. Here she is, all the way from Weathersfield Elementary School. Do I still get a piece of candy after? Uh -huh. Ladies and gentlemen, my 1,000th sexual conquest is this largemouth bass. Yeah, yeah, that's right. I'm weird. Someday, I'm gonna kick his ass. Damn it, Peter, I'm sick of this. I've had it. Me too. You know what? You're full of it. If you were ever face-to-face -face with Liam Neeson, you'd crap your pants. No, I wouldn't. Well, fine. Let's prove it. Put up or shut up. Right now. Liam Neeson has three more hours to live. Let's do this. All right. Ugh. I've never been to Connecticut. All right, Peter, Liam Neeson must be on the other side of that barrier. We just got to get you on that set so you can kick his ass. We're so close, I can almost taste his ass. What? Miss right, Tammy's in a car yelling at a boyfriend almost on the phone taste again. His ass. So it looks like I'm doing lunch. Oh, there's nothing to cut these with. If you're going to seduce my mother, then I shall seduce yours. Wake up, Griffin. Your bail's been posted. You posted my bail? I hear you've been all over town saying you could kick my arse. Oh, no, 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 Mr. Neeson, you heard wrong. There's nobody who respects you more than I do. Ah! Ow! Oh, please don't hurt me. I was just trying to seem tough in front of my friends. I've been a world-famous tough guy since I was 55. Hmm. Well, I could save me some time in the morning. But whatever it takes for you to not beat me up. All right, it's a deal. You can help me with some chores. All right, Landon. Let's see how you like it when someone moves in on your territory. Ow, my knee! <laughs> I want you to take over my Twitter feed and tweet back to my fans. What I need you to do is to go to a local gym and ask men to pee in your hands. I, I, I don't see the connection there. Hey, man, did Liam Neeson send you? <laughs> yeah, he loves them little cars. Whoa! Hey, guys. What the hell? You're out of jail. How'd you get out? Well, glad you're back. So, you ready to admit you're never going to kick Liam Neeson's ass? Hi, Peter. I'm out of crackers and I'm gluten-free. So what I need you to do is go to a local gym and ask man to pee in your hands. What the hell? No way your son would learn the drums in that amount of time. Oh, that tears it. <laughs> oh! Oh! <laughs> 
You guys must think I'm pathetic. Are you kidding? You took on the star of Kinsey. Yeah, and more importantly, you followed through on your drunken rave. I'll just wait till somebody else goes in. Well, that wasn't helpful. Wow, look at this place. There's candles, hand lotion. Whoa, this... After the other night, I made a decision. From now on, I'm only using women's restrooms. What? You can't do that. You're a man. You'll get in trouble. Wow, this is the nicest one yet. Eh, what are the odds she's gonna show up? Did you get your ass kicked by Meryl Streep? Ah, the ladies' room at Wimbledon. This must be the fanciest bathroom in the world. <sighs> okay, Stewie, you're gonna help Daddy by holding his iPad while he watches season one of House of Cards. We now return to Sunday Golf on CBS. And Mickelson here trying to save Parr. And there's Mickelson's wife. God, is she hot. Look at that rack. There's a downhill lie for you. Oh, and they're just out there begging to be touched, pleading. How many golf balls do you think she can fit in her mouth? I'd hit that one in the rough if you know what I'm saying. Who are you kidding, Greg? You'd pork her for a week and then get tired of her. Yeah, you're right. That's what I do. That's my thing. But a hell of a week, though. Hell of a week. <laughs> but a hell of a I week, though. I just got an idea. <laughs> a much better idea than when I did magic for the That's blind. One. You guys got me. Is Bruh. this your card? I don't know. Was it a red card? I don't know what red is. Ta-da! Kids, kids, kids! Shiny, gooey, stretchy, fun! Hasbro's best thing ever! Sticky, yummy, bouncy, fun! Hasbro's best go. thing ever! Fly it! Yeah! Toss it! Awesome! Swim it! Ah! Eat it! Whoa! Hasbro's best thing ever! Kids! Kids! Ah! It's so awesome! What? I want it! We now return to Superman 5, The Broken Condom. Hey, Lois, ready to go to dinner? Yeah, sure. Just let me grab my purse. Okay, ready. Ooh, on second thought, I got something I gotta do back on Krypton. I thought Krypton was destroyed. I think we should see other people. <laughs> oh, wait! <laughs> ah. We now return to Harrison Ford telling random people he wants his family back. Oh. I want my family back. Okay. Give me back my family. Get off me! I want my family back. <laughs> oh. We are going to patrol the borders and keep this town as clean as a Jewish porno. I own four apartment buildings. Mm. I have central air. Oh. And a well-funded 401k. Oh, we are going to have sex at some point. The fuck we is? That son of a bitch. He's a killer like Bernie Getz. Who's you know, Bernie the Getz? subway vigilante from the 80s? Where? I, I used to do a bit about him back when I was doing stand-up. Ah, what else is in the news? Oh, 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 Bernie Getz. You, do, do, you hear, do you hear about this? Th th this guy, Bernie Getz, shot a bunch of muggers on the subway. Wouldn't mind having him with me next time I go see my mother-in-law. <laughs> no, but really, New York City's a great place to live if you're a cockroach. You suck! I know. I got no money. I couldn't even afford to get my hair cut yesterday. That'll be five dollars. Sorry, lost my wallet. But I already cut your hair. Eh, well, guess there's nothing you can do about it now. That son of a bitch. Brian, you have got to get Dylan under control. He's terrorizing the whole family. Yeah, you wouldn't believe what he did to Meg yesterday. He made her watch the other 178 hours of Monty Python stuff that isn't funny or memorable. I have a pet hedgehog named Zippy, and I shall walk her to town. And each time my foot hits the ground, I shall say boing, boing, boing. I'm a girl! I don't even like the good Monty Python sketches. And I'll stick to that story even if nobody believes it. I'll tell you what nobody believes in. Ghosts! Where did Robinson Crusoe go with Friday on Saturday night? Ha! Ah, damn. Play me off, Johnny. You're probably wondering why he's in hell. Ah. Johnny liked little boys. <laughs> Sounds like you need a roommate. Where'd Shit. you get that kind of money? I picked up Chris's paper route. Damn. Gosh, gosh, bagosh, it's a brand new paper boy. That's a mighty full sack you're carrying. Piss off, you perverted old freak. Oh, we got a fighter. Sometimes I feel more useless than the head of the maids union. And what exactly are your demands? 
We need more lemon pledge. You need more lemon pledge? Yes. We're not responsible for that. You should just bring it from your own home. No. I am going to kick him out of this house faster than NASA kicked out the Cocoa Puffs bird. Okay, your physical exam was within range. You aced the flight simulator. I guess all that's left is the psychological screening. Okay. How do you feel about this? Ah, oh my god, Cocoa Puffs. No, that's not me anymore. Yeah. I'm just here to fly, sir. Oh, that's awesome. Coming this fall on Fox, a new reality show. Who wants to marry Corky from Life Goes On? You won't believe what happened. Ew, they could get surgery. See, look, Meg, he just walked out on you. He's a bad man, like Jodie Foster. Which one's Jodie Foster? Oh, no, Jody, it's my husband. He's home from work early. Don't worry, baby. He had to find out sometime. Now you're talking, Angela. This country needs more immigrants like my cousin Peter the Pig needs a new house. Uh, I wouldn't do that if I were you. What? I said I wouldn't do that. I said knock it off. Why? Because I just made stool in there, and if you blow it down, the whole woods is going to stink. Do you understand? Do you understand me, sir? You better shoot this motherfucker. I had another date. You know, I'm glad you're finally putting yourself out there. Lois would have wanted you to move on. Yeah, only this one was kind of awkward. My date was a stick figure. So, I, how would this work in, in bed? Well, I can't do sex, but I can give you a stick job. That, uh, that sounds... Yes, it is very unpleasant. <laughs> ah! yes, My parents are not going to like this, Peter. You know, they're yeah. still angry at how you behaved at our wedding. That's like the you may now laugh, kiss yo. the bride. Kiss her? I am going to destroy her. But the freakiest was that date I had with Barney. Peter, you don't know how badly I need this. I don't know, Barney. It's, it's just a little weird. Joe's a friend of mine. No, it, it's okay. I promise you, it's okay. I'm not sure. It's okay, Peter. Tonight's movie presentation is brought to you by Sanka. Don't you wanna wanna sanka? Uh, uh, Don't you wanna uh, wanna sanka? Uh, Don't you ugly wanna bitches! Wanna ugly bitches! It doesn't keep me up at night, but it helps me poo. Wrinkly titty. The only job I could find was for a phone sex line, and I sucked at it. Yeah, you're terrible what at phone wearing? sex. Um, a hat and glasses. I can't stand these type of hoes. Kind of underwear. Um, I don't know. Big underwear, I guess. Motherfucker. I'm sorry, what? He's gonna ruin. Oh, he's gonna what ruin. What would I do to you? Well, um, I guess maybe we'd get pizza. He's gonna ruin my erection, huh? We could watch House. All right, I am totally flashing, yep. but thank you anyway, <laughs> ma'am. I appreciate your time. We now return <laughs> to busy business lady whose life is missing something, but she doesn't realize it because she's so busy with business. Completely no, flashing, No, I cannot lady. make that business meeting. I've got a different business meeting at three, and we'll be doing business there. I was wondering if you're free for coffee. Oh, no, I can't. I've got a lunch meeting, and then a meeting after lunch. After that... Shh, shh, shh. Over the next 90 minutes, I'd like to show you that all your problems can be solved by my penis. That's real. Free burgers? Oh, man, this is a way better offer than the one I got from Helen Hunt. You want to have sex? No. Yes. No, no, yes. no, 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 no. We're going to have a real raging time. Before you know it, we'll be like an old married couple. Who would want this? Where's the sex? I wouldn't want, I don't want this. I don't want to stare the first thing at we're going to do is get you a years? perfect fake ID. I know a guy who does good work. You took a big risk coming here, man. James Woods could be back any minute. I know. How fast can you do it? As fast as Spider-Man when he gets laid. Oh, God. I'm so sorry. It, that's never happened to me before. It's just you're so attractive, and it's been a while. I'm going to go. Yep. You know, some people say that's good for your hair. Hey, look on the bright side. The no-fat people will give you high fives. Ha-ha! <laughs> Immediately on contact! Yeah! Two pumps and an apology! <laughs> I just wonder if she'd even want to see me. I wasn't exactly the nicest guy in the world. And then, in high school, I was violated sexually by my father. So? It happened on numerous occasions, and I was too afraid to tell anyone because I felt like, somehow, it was my fault. You're taking your bra off or not, bitch? Oh. So, you do go all the way. <laughs> yeah! Your life would have been more miserable than a lonely old widow living in a downstairs apartment. Ah! 
Quiet! Keep it down up there! <sighs> what did I just say? I'm calling the police! Oh, he killed her. Just like the telephone killed the telegraph sex business. Did it? Hey, baby, I bet you're hot. Stop. Describe to me what you're doing to yourself right now. Stop. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, nasty! Uh? This is a bigger disaster than Jack Black's last movie. We now return to Jack Black in The Unconventional Butler. Edgar, could you bring me some tea? Yeah! Yeah! Wait a minute. Butlers are supposed to be fancy and well-mannered. This guy's screaming and waving his arms around. You're an old man. You don't understand the young people. You're right. I'll change from now on. Hello, operator. Crestview 4162, please. One moment, please. Did anyone ever do phone stuff like that? Maybe. Hello. 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 Well, well, what do you know, know about that? that? You and I will be the best brother sister team since Maggie and Jake Gyllenhaal. I'm more off putting. No, I'm more off putting. I'm more unattractive to put in a lead role. Well, I'm a bigger box office drag. Kids, kids, you're both just awful. <laughs> Ugh, that's the ugliest thing the fat man's grown since that horse leg. Hey, Peter, have you seen my... Oh, my God. Oh, Brian, I'm sorry, but what do I keep saying? Do not stand behind me, because I will get scared. Oh, crap, Peter, it's a flash flood. Oh, man, I better save my autographed picture of Dean Kane. You know, from before he got all desperate for attention. Hey, is that Dean Kane on that park bench? Oh, God. I'm sorry, Mayor McCheese, but I'm not sure if any cosmetic surgery is even possible. Look, if it's a financial issue... Well, it's not an issue of money. Your head is a cheeseburger. There's no blood flow to it. It's just, it's just dead cow meat. All right, well, I appreciate you giving it to me straight. All right, then. Have a tasty afternoon. <laughs> ah, there's a smile. Rob? Hey! Hey, how are you? God, it's good to see you. Good to see you, too. How's my dog? I'm, I'm sorry, your dog. Oh... Oh, I, I had to give him away. Gave him away! Well, Dave's allergic. Dave! All right, so there's a Dave. That's great. God, Dave it's sounds great. Dave. Yeah, he is. And his parents are so sweet. Oh, met his parents and they're sweet. Just older Daves, huh? <laughs> what a family. God, it's good to see you. Do dudes really do this shit? Damn! Even I'd have told him to set the fuck up. It's taken us all by surprise, Meg. Like that realistic original ending to Dirty Dancing. Nobody puts baby in a corner. I do, because I'm her father and she's 16. What are you, like 38? 41. <laughs> no. 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 We don't deserve this, do we? Do you? Tricking her should be easier than escaping from Canadian Alcatraz. Can I go through here? Just be back by bedtime, okay. No, I wasn't. I was at the carnival with Rupert. Ah, oh, the carnival with Rupert. We won! We won! Do it again! Now I want a pink one! <laughs> Stewie, we've been playing for half an hour. Oh, okay. You want to go ride the tea bags? Teacups? I am gonna grow a mustache. And I'll have it made like the Monopoly guy. Except when he goes directly to jail. I wish I could tell you that the Monopoly guy fought the good fight, and the sisters let him be. I wish I could tell you that. But prison is no fairy tale world. No, no, he's dead. He's dead. Just like the Pink Panther. What's wrong with him, Doctor? Well, it seems his lungs are completely filled with Owen's Corning fiberglass insulation. What? Will he be okay? No, he won't be okay. One third of his body weight is Owen's Corning fiberglass insulation. Oh. Well, that's it. But don't worry. He won't burn in hell, thanks to all that Owens Corning fiberglass insulation. You know, this resort offers some wonderful amenities. They have bird watching, wine tasting, horseback riding. Hey, they also have stork startling. Squawkity, 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 squawkity! <laughs> Your bird intelligence is no match for my people intelligence. This 
Have you ever seen your father do anything bad? Well, now that you mention it. Hey, Meg. Proud of you. We now return to Dr. Terry Fabulous, homosexual gynecologist. Okay, Mrs. Robinson, let's take a look. Ew, it looks like a sad old man. Hell yeah, it does. Here, check this out. Wow, this is cool. Yeah, everyone in the neighborhood has one. <laughs> hey, why would you hang that up? It looks so tantalizing. You know, it's funny. From this position, I can hear Meg upstairs. I'm going to pretend you're the New York Knicks. I got more money than Barbara Streisand. Honey, I'm going shopping. Hell yeah. And I was going to valet park. Play our cards right. It could be bigger than the Apollo Theater. All right, now. Next up, we got the comedy stylings of Kim Lee Sung. Give it up. How you doing tonight? So you ever notice when two black guys come in your convenience store and one go one way and one go the other way? What they doing? What they stealing? Who with me? <laughs> you stay out my store. All you stay out my store. I remember your face. I shouldn't have stayed up all night listening to Persian radio. Hey, that was Roxette with You've Got the Look. It's 21 o'clock and still 27 centigrade out there. Ooh, that's hot. So, if you're cruising along the left side of the road at 120 kilometers per hour in the heavy desert, turn up the decibels, because it's Shaleb Mami with Zechech Malech on 103.2, the Hach. Ooh, Horton hears domestic violence in the next apartment and doesn't call 911. Oh. You think it's easy working all day? No. You think I, I like it? I don't think it's easy, but yes, I do think you like no, it. No, I, yeah, I like being away from you because I can't stand looking at you. You <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you think I want to do that? You think I want to hurt you? That is I don't want to hurt you. Dang. I'm sure there's two sides you to this. Like there usually you. is to... Yeah, you we're not complete without you. Joe. You remember when he bailed on us for that trip to the spa and we had to find another handicapped guy? God, Seamus, I've, uh, never seen you this naked. Ah, it's good to let the old midsection breathe. What, uh, how the hell are you alive? I don't think you realize the danger. Like the people who think it's okay to bring shampoo on an airplane. So I told Brenda, I work hard, I like a clean house when I come home. And now I'm the bad guy. Oh, I know exactly where you're coming. Ow, it's in my eyes! Oh, my God. We now return to The Hills. Justin, Bobby was supposed to be here already. Are you still going out with him? I guess so. I hate how he pushes his bangs out of his face with every word he says. Um, order me a beer. I have to find a spot for my motorcycle. Well, believe it or not, I pop in every hundred years or so, kind of incognito, just to get away from the family. Plus, the timing seemed good, because my dad just quit smoking, and he's a little on edge. Who took my checkbook? Ellen? Why is there a pen cap and no pen? There's no way I can compete against those other kids. It's like trying to beat Spoople champion Fjord van der Plug at a game of Spoople. Oh, don't be sad, Peter. That's why they call it Spoopal. We now return to Jackass. Hello, my name's Johnny Knoxville, and I'm going to take a shotgun blast to the face. What okay, the hell? Ready? I just hope Dad doesn't embarrass us like he did when that one-legged guy came over. All right, well, if you like movie trivia, I got one that'll stump you. Uh, of course, you're probably not really into tibia trivia. Uh, boy, that global warming, huh? They say we lost a foot of snow last winter. Uh, hey, how about another beer, huh? I bet you like the taste of hops. Uh, you only have one leg, sir. Absolutely. This world needs you, Jesus. It needs you like a guy who can't get it up needs a distraction. I am so ready to have sex with you. Oh, hey, is that my phone? I don't hear anything. Is that John Aston? I don't see anyone out there. Oh. Well, now there's so much going on. All right, I'll do it. 
Boy, you're more persuasive than James Bond. Now, time for some unfinished business. No, James. Yes. No, James. Yes, you are going to have sex with me. No, James, I don't want to. Yes, you do. No, I don't. Yes, you do. No, I don't. Yes, you do. Okay, yes. See that? 50 no's and a yes means yes. It does. That is literally how it's done. This is perfect, Lois. We'll expose Loretta for who she is. Just like Cyrano was exposed for being anti-Semitic. I love you for all that you are. In spite of the fact that your people control a disproportionate amount of the world's wealth and in all likelihood are probably responsible for starting every major war since the dawn of time. Dude, again with this? What's your problem? Who's in the bush? Mind your own business, you stupid Jew. Dad, this is stupid. I'm so bored. How can you be bored? This convention has everything. You can even try on LeVar Burton's visor. Ah, ah, ah! Why would he wear these? Who would invent these for him? We now return to Lady and the Tramp and Michael Vick. Oh. Bro, this, this, this never gets any less sad. Oh. Oh. Hey, maybe we can go to the island from Lost. No, I don't want to listen to Matthew Fox's heavy breathing. <laughs> Kate, you don't get it. We are the island. <sighs> Hand me that paper bag. Jack, that's got my poop in it. I know. I know. It's got a hint of coconut in it and something else. But that's part of the mystery. Yeah, Quagmire and Cleveland are great with kids, like Robin Williams and Patch Adams. Huh, everybody's lying around in here. Liar, liar, pants on fire. What am I, in Congress? Huh, huh, see? Laughter is the best medicine. Please, Please sir, I'm in so much pain. Shut up and listen to my material. <laughs> huh, what's this? Bedpan, Peter Pan. Oh, next stop is Neverland. Come, Wendy, fly with me. Ho, ho. Did this nigga really do that? We what? went to Barney's. I heard that's where all the famous people shop for skinny leg jeans. Whoa! These are the tightest, penis compressingest, sperm killingest, testicle grippingest jeans I ever tried on! It's, it's all I have so far. That was horrible. You're as bad as Beethoven near the end. They're gonna love that. You're getting old, Brian, and they know it. You're no longer the cover girl. Look at Carol Alt. That, that's what. You, you're Carol Alt. So I'm through listening to you. Fine. Think what you want, aging supermodel Carol Alt. Carol, come in here. They're saying your name on the family man. What? Huh? What? Huh? What? I forget. Trust me, you guys are going to get along better than Abraham Lincoln and his neighbor. Hey, Dale. I noticed your lawn's getting a little high. Yeah, I used to have a guy for that. Dick. Okay, now you have a good one. Oh, Punky, you have a dog named Brandon. <laughs> Hi, I'm Carol Alt for Polygrip. They did it again! Polygrip? Oh. The family man! Is that, Is that the one with the fish? No, that's American Boy. Is that Lou? Oh, boy, I usually only get this excited when they say the title of a movie in the movie. I'm telling you, these drug dealers represent a clear and present danger to the United States. Yeah, yeah, he said it, he said it. All I'm saying is, what if this is as good as it gets? Oh. Ah, ah, there it is! There it is! The only way for me to solve this crisis is to be Superman 4, the quest for peace. Oh, that's why they call it that. I have been taking it slow. We've been going out for three weeks and I haven't tried anything, even though she's been giving me some pretty strong signals. So, do you have any thoughts on what you might want to do tonight? It's far better to go too fast than to go too slow. I'm just saying. Oh, I don't know. Don't listen to Brian Lois. You'd be great on camera. Like I was when I played that dead body on Law and Order. Well, until I got that itch in my crotch. The contusion on his left temple implies he was hit by a blunt object, and the cuts imply a struggle. So it was murder. But the question is who? Well, whoever it was wears nail polish. We found traces in the wounds. Well, that narrows it down. At least we know it wasn't the father. Yeah, but we still gotta find out... Ah, uh, thank God. 
You need to stop pointing fingers and get out of the house. Have some fun. Real fun. Not like 37-year-old woman on a blind date fun. Oh, this is fun, right? We're having fun. I mean, so what if you forgot your wallet? I'll pay. I'm gonna pay for us. You'll get it next time, yeah. So you were in prison, right? Killed a man? Oh, I'm sure it was in self-defense. No, I just felt like killing. Ah! Oh, you tell the best stories. Me and my three eggs are having the best time. We now return to Robert Mitchum in Out of Shape, In Shape Guy from the 50s. Gambling is illegal in this town. Says who? Says me. You got a problem with that? I'm not really sure. Kind of waiting for you to exhale. <sighs> Actually, yeah, I do have a problem with that. All right, that's it. We got to do something about this. We have got to get that record and destroy it. Just like that fat person surgery destroyed Star Jones's arms. Well, uh, baby girl. I sick. look so good. I lost all this weight. Oh my god. Taxi! Oh my god. Oh Coming my to show God. the people how good I look. Oh, my God. And all the juice is being collected underneath? Yes, and whoever collects the most is going to win a free weekend here at the Chateau with international foods and wine tasting. Stop. Uh-huh. Oh. 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 Boy, am I going to enjoy this meal. Not like last night when I didn't have time to poop before the guests arrived. Do I have time? You know what? I'm going to go for it. Son of a bitch. Looks like I'm going to have to pile dinner on top of that. Hey, guys, how are ya? Look. When we're done with him, he'll be more of an outcast than a seagull at an Adam Sandler movie. Who stabbed you in the shoulder? This is my old bicycle that I had from when I was ten. Sometimes the banana seat hurts my hiney. Will you shut up? You shut up, man. It's a comedy. When I ring the bell, it makes my pants feel funny. Ring, ring, ring. And when he does, I'll grab his hand and yank him out of there. Peter, I don't think... Shh, it's starting. Two and a Half Men was filmed in front of a live ostrich. Boy, this stinks. It's Friday night and I don't have a date. Well then, let me get you a number from my little black book. Ha <laughs> ha! Ladies and gentlemen, Scarlett Johansson and for some reason, Steve Buscemi. Man, look at that Steve Buscemi. Every one of his teeth is in business for itself. You know, Steve, the art director's job is never an easy one. That's right, Scarlett. But this year... Hey, where are you going? I'm going to the Elton John party. What the hell? I told you we were staying for the governor's ball. And I told you, Tim, we would see how the evening plays out. Ah, <sighs> it's another pleasant day for me, Peter the Strawberry. Hey, Mr. Worm, I welcome your arrival because we're all part of the same garden. Nope, sure don't. Wait, oh, my wait, God. Wait, hey, 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 get out of here. I'll fight to hey. the death. Ah, 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 I'll fight ah, to the death. Ah, ah, ah. He was my neighbor, and he violated me. You had to kill me. Now I'll never end up in a fancy pie. You had to kill me. Well, it's a long shot, but so was the shouting Arab Graham business. From John and Keith. You've got to be aggressive, even more aggressive than Michael Jackson's treatment of his own groin on stage. <laughs> I could never do that to my people. There's one person I really want you to meet. Oh, yeah? Who's that? The American people may have turned against the war, but I answer to a higher power. I answer to the power of Jesus Christ. Oh, well, uh, that's funny because I happen to have Jesus Christ right here. I heard what you were saying. You know nothing of my work. How you ever got to be president of anything is totally amazing. Boy, wouldn't it be great if life were like this? We now return to Meredith Baxter mm. in... Raped by a clown. What? It was awful. He made me do things. Awful things. What kinds of things? I don't even want to talk about it. Which means I've got to get a job. Otherwise, we'll be in worse shape than morbidly obese Albert. 
Hey, morbidly obese Albert, we brought you some chocolates. Oh, I can't eat those chocolates on account of my diabetes. Remember they had to take my foot? Look on the bright side. Now you get your shoes half price. Ha, ha, ha. All right, maybe I'll have one. Oh, did he eat seven? Are you kidding? We'll go together better than Hannity and Combs. My problem with liberals, Alan, is that liberals hate America. Sean, I don't know if that's true. You just contradicted me. You hate America. If I could just get a word in. You hate America. You like the terrorists. Well, I guess you're right again. Well, Brian, looks like you're the odd man out, like a non-praying mantis. Bless us, O oh Lord, for these gifts we are about to receive. Help us to be mindful of all our blessings and... Come on, let's head home before Stewie gets hurt, like Fozzie Bear when he went to Saudi Arabia. Uh, it's good to worship Allah, because I used to worship Summer. Waka waka. <laughs> I once knew a guy who was so Arab. How Arab was he? Uh, he was so Arab that everybody liked him, and there was nothing funny about him at all. Ha! Huh, your kid got beat up by a baby girl. Oh, man, this is oh. more painful to watch than when Family Ties does a Tina Yothers episode. Jennifer, what happened in school today? I got my period. And I will see the Keaton family next week. Well, we can't just leave Mort back in time. That'd be more irresponsible than silent movie porn. You're a handsome woman. Motherfucker, what? No! And I'm quite baldy. Indeed, I did. It suffered a fatal heart attack from the excitement, and I disposed of it properly. Oh. oh, boy. I miss the old days when it was just a flaming bag of poop and a hurtful note. My nigga said well, a flaming I bag of poop and a hurtful note. Newspaper. Yeah, didn't you do an interview with that fast-talking FedEx guy? Yeah, I ended up dating him for three months. That's a beautiful shade of lipstick. I bet you enjoy the music of Men at Work. You're incredibly foxy. Take off your shirt, take off your pants. Wow, what a body. That feels good. I'll give you a call. You better get tested. Oh. Peter, it's been eight hours, and I haven't heard back from Cleveland or Quagmire. I even tried Joe. This is my wheelchair. There are many like it, but this one is mine. Without me, my wheelchair is useless. Without my wheelchair, I am useless. Shut up! Okay. Lois, don't ruin this for me. Don't ruin this like you're ruined Kick cereal. Mmm, this Kick cereal is good tasting. And it's good for you. Nah. Oh, boy, I'm so hungry I could eat a horse. I, uh, I misspoke. <laughs> <laughs> Paid 15 cents for this ticket. <laughs> oh, no, he didn't. God, could he be any more annoying? Oh, hey, it's Tom. Tommy! <laughs> hey, hey, here you took that black chick home. Hey, hey, you're welcome. <laughs> oh. He's not the dog he used to be, and I'll have to get used to it. Just like I got used to my acrylic nails. Oh. Ooh. Scanyan, Weinstock, and Reisman. Hey, LaRonda. No, I got four people on hold, but I can't talk. <laughs> you can't have sex? Uh, no. But, yes. Tina, we're married. Yes. Tony Randall was married, Lois. Rock Hudson was married. Ronald Reagan was married. Mr. President, did you reach a missile pact? Well, you could say that. There was a missile. And something definitely got packed. <laughs> God, you're more out of place than Prince was on The Price is Right. And what's your bid on the dining room set, Prince? Three fifty. I'm sorry? Three fifty. Can you speak up, please? Three fifty. All right, and the actual retail price of the dining room set is three hundred fifty dollars. Yay. After we eat, we can watch that YouTube footage of Miley Matlin calling movie phone. Please say the name of the movie you'd like to see now. The Nast Mim Team. I'm sorry, I didn't catch that. 
Please say the name of the movie you'd like to see now. The last Memphis. You have selected 300. If this is the movie you'd like to see, say yes now. No. You have confirmed 300. None of this is awkward. I've moved on from Jillian. I've dated plenty of other girls since her. I never do computer dating. Yeah, me neither. So, you're 27? Well, that, that picture was, you know, it was posted a couple years ago. So, so you're, you're a golden retriever? Well, it's a retriever mix, Esopique Bay, Bradoodle. Where, where is that waitress? Perfect. Now I won't have to take that job as Matt Damon's Nick. Hey, Matt. Oh. Matt. Hey, is this another one of those movies where you're an educated Boston street tough? I don't have to take that crap from you, Nick. Oh, you have to, my friend. I'm your Nick. What are you going to do, choke me? You'll die. You'll die if you do that. Can somebody from wardrobe get me a scarf? Oh, I'm still going to... I'll just talk louder. Ben Affleck married Jennifer Garner, but you married a bartender with a kid. These are facts. God, I hate cops. Almost as much as I hated my overly sensitive car alarm. Bitch. And you better be responsible tonight. I don't want a repeat of the last time I left you alone with one of our children. <gasps> it's just so horrible. I'm sorry, Lois. I thought if I shook him enough, he'd stop crying. I was kind of right. Technically, You're gonna fail faster than John Madden's wedding video business. Mike and Stacy's wedding. Boom! Here's your groom over here. Boom! You got your bride right here. A lot of people say that Stacy's no good and that she slept with this guy and done that guy and even this guy. But I'll tell you something. That experience is going to work in her favor no. late in the game. No, it's not. You know what? A heck of a wedding. Brett Favre. So, Lauren, do you and Paris Hilton and Lindsay Lohan all hang out and go drunk driving together? I heard that Lindsay Lohan wasn't driving that night. She was taking the rap for a friend. Wrong! Oh, no, I already have two strikes. I'll take the wheel, Mr. Magoo. I'm too old to go to prison. They'll rape me, and I'll never see them coming. No, I won't. Well, it sure is odd. Oh, you gonna see them coming. You gonna see them coming. <laughs> record doesn't just get up and walk away, except for my old Alan Sherman record. If you ain't gonna play me, don't complain when I try to split. There's a lot of Jews out there still get a laugh off of Hello Mudder, Hello Fodder. Ooh, such heat this morning. I don't need this jacket. Why would she go out with me? She must be more drunk than Santa Claus when he got that DUI. Oh, no, it wasn't my fault. Some guy in a Plymouth totally cut me off. Sir, they don't make Plymouths anymore. Are you Jewish? Sir, I'm gonna need you to step out of the sleigh. Damn. Uh, this is gonna be a bigger pain in the ass than getting into a last clap contest with Cleveland. Ladies and gentlemen, the Quahog Men's Chorus. Hey, hey, hey! Clap one more time, you're not coming to my birthday. Who did that? Giggity! I want to thank you all for coming out here today. We got a serious situation down in the Bronx. Our friend needs to get a message to the short man in the hat. He needs to deliver this message before the construction site contracts are handed down. It's of vital importance that these matters... So your clip selection in this Try Not to Laugh Family Guy Challenge is so good, not only are you an official Hot Cheeto taster, but instead of two Hot Cheetos per bag, you get four Hot Cheetos per bag. You can thank me later after the many, many mornings and nights of molten hot horrible diarrhea hope you guys enjoyed the video if you did make sure to comment like and or subscribe it's your boy blast miss hd twisms